Hello? Hi guys, how are you doing? Let me actually adjust my mic. How are you guys doing? Today, I'm playing- I'm, this is a fully blind game. For me, at least. Uh, I've never seen anything about this game. It's called- I'm actually streaming two games, actually. It's uh, milk inside of, of a bag of milk. Inside of a bag of milk. Longest title for a game ever! And also, the sequel, uh, it's milk outside of a bag of milk, outside of a bag of milk. Actually, I think I said it like- did I say inside the bag of milk twice? Or three times? I don't know. But I'm playing that. <laughs> I, in America, we don't actually do bags of milk. I, the, I know the creator of the game is actually... I think it's Ru the creator of the game is Russian. So I think they do it there. Hi, Mpex. But, oh yeah, hi guys. I, I, hi, Mpex. Hi, uh, Peppermint. Hi to Kylo. I think... Uh... Sorcerer is there too. Hi, Sorcerer. But I'm also joined with... a. Uh, Ran and JD. Ran and JD, say your catchphrase. You interrupted us. We were talking. Dude. What about what? Oh my God! This guy doesn't know because he muted us. And I was and talking to the cast audience. Us away. Cast Dude, us like, away. I could like kill for a bowl of Cheerios. Um, what's cracking, guys? That's your catchphrase. That's that's there what I'm go. talking about. I don't think I have one, but I don't care. Make one. There's a snake in your boot. Oh, I need to uh, add Ren to the speaking. Uh, you can't just say that. I you need to activate her. Spot. Don't activate me. No. Let me die in peace. Wait, where even are you? Do I have you? Oh. Oh, there you I go, just... found you. <laughs> uh, just realized something. Uh, I might go and get dinner real quickly in a moment. Not yet. Oh my god, you're leaving already. We can do the phone. We can do the phone thing. <laughs> That's always good. That's always fun. So apparently this game is super short. It's like ten minutes. Oh Hopefully yeah, the audio like is a good. short stream today, everyone. Guys, we should speak. 
Oh, let me let me stream for JD and Ren. Yeah. I love I love the language. That's not that's just Russian. Okay, English. <laughs> we love translation. Oh, Nikita Kriev. That's that's a person you uh, oh, okay, I'm Windows mode, which is good. I used the alt, sh alt, uh, enter. Help me buy milk! Oh, dude, I was talking to JD about this. You know about the, the goldfish and milk strat? I do. Yo, we, we talked about it yesterday, where oh, you, you eat a bunch of goldfish and you, like, chug a, a no, sip no, of milk. No, 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 just a little drop of milk. Yeah, a sip, a, sip, a little sippy. A little sippy. Yeah. Otherwise... It it kind of gross. It's not a speedy stream. I'm gonna stream. I'm also gonna. It's looking stream like a the quick sequel. stream tonight. Okay. Write down your name. Oh, what should I? Uh, I'll write down my real name. OCL. Hopefully, I don't get doxxed. I'll walk, I down, walk the down the road. Down the road to the OCL store. Er, that's not what they say. And rehearse my speech. Um, it's been so long since I've been out of the house that I've completely forgot what words to say when entering a store. I'm going to the store. Shut up and go already. What are you talking? Um, who are you talking to? I'm imagining it as if I were a character in a game. What if help? What if it helps me gather my thoughts? What game? Well, you know, <laughs> er, meta. There are games where you can see the character's thoughts right on the screen. You know. Actually, lower the volume a little bit. So I thought, if someone was reading my mind, I need to be very focused so I don't blur out too much. Ha! Take a deep breath of air. Hello, can I? <laughs> this is a very good voice for the person mm. speaking. He's voicing yourself. Oh, yeah, well, that's what I sound like. 19th attempt, and I'm already failing again. I bite my lip in frustration. So once again, hello, can I get... It's a whole word. It's a whole word more. Thank you, I'm trying my best. I think this time the L sound was longer than usual. Do you think that's it? Who knows? Hello, can I? I wish I hadn't said Hello. anything. Hello. Hello. Hello, loser. Don't insult me, please. By the way, you've been walking with your left foot on the pavement and your right foot on the grass for a full minute now. Or what? My right foot is frozen in the air. How much? 50 steps on the pavement and 51 in the grass. Oh. You I'll have to undo you. the previous step. This is, you're, this, getting, you're getting the grass ending right now. I Not think we thing. have OCD. <laughs> <laughs> How do you imagine that? Hi, Ryuji. It's not the first time this has happened. Just, I'm not, I'm not going to insult myself. I've been taught the right way, haven't you? Come on. I don't remember. Ray the burst into tears. I just want to get milk. I'm, like, dying. Yeah, this guy's not getting milk. This guy's getting the grass ending. <laughs> no! Here we go again. So... Step one, take a step back to get your foot exactly in your own footprint. Ow. Wait a minute, what do you mean step one? What then? Wait, it's already the 50th, 52nd. Oh wait, I'm going backwards, so then it's the 50th? That doesn't add up. This guy, we're bad enough. Okay, hey, step 50, take a step back to get your own foot exactly in with your footprint. Could you rephrase it a little bit? You can't just repeat a phrase without changing at least one word. People don't, people don't talk like that. You sound like the, uh, the cricket. <laughs> You'd really take a step You're back, horrible. Jack? You'd really take a step back, Jack? Stop hooking. Hi, Nasai hey, oh, uh, and uh, Funimono. You're not going to allow... I'm <laughs> <laughs> about to go to the store and buy some milk, Jack, aren't you? Oh, Jack, you're not about to put the shopping cart right in the parking lot, are you? You're not about to blow up... Uh, oh, to not to wreck me in a parking lot, Jack. Oh, oh, the wind! You're hopeless. You think it sound like it's my fault? Oh no, now I'm doing it again. <laughs> the store closes in an hour, so you will be very, very guilty if you don't buy milk. G who? Guilty from who? Who's gonna, like, punish me? The I guess myself. God. The milk god! Damn. Damn, really? Are you ready? Hell yes. I carefully move my foot backwards, looking carefully it's into the dense grass. It's too late. He's already locked into the grass ending. <laughs> As I enter the store, I turn to the very first person I see. Hello, can I? Uh oh. Um. The creature? Oh! Excuse me, what? Oh! Excuse me, what? Oh! <laughs> Excuse me, what? Unlocked. Oh, I got the grass ending, okay. Yeah. Excuse me, what? Oh! Excuse me, what? Oh! Excuse. 
Shouldn't have done that. Uh oh. Yeah, locked into grass ending for sure. He's obviously not gonna change his lines. You gotta you run the risk of ending up in an endless loop. Excuse me, what? Oh, excuse me, what? Oh, excuse me, what? Oh, excuse me, what? <laughs> it's getting bigger. Excuse me, what? <laughs> Everyone's just saying oh and shit. Oh, what? Oh, what is he trying to tell you? He's trying to scare me, but how does he know that I'm terrified by the letter O? Somebody's so scary about it. I have a fretting image when I picture it in my head. I can show you, explaining won't be enough, but keep in mind that it'll cost me a dozen. Okay. That is scary. Stream <laughs> yeah, Goatsy, are you kidding me? Um, I'm gonna oh, get bad. Man, man. <laughs> Something like that. Stream Goatsy, I just realized you said that. <laughs> so I'll just continue to ignore his question. What? Oh. What? Oh. What? Oh. What? Oh. I gathered all my will into a fist. Oh, God. Oh? Oh! oh, I thought, I thought, I thought they were gonna punch him. Me too. I got, oh, I got, I got the O achievement. Oh yeah, oh my God. baby. I'm, I'm kind of winning. Wait, wait, I gotta show this. You guys are not gonna, you guys are gonna make, freak this grass, out. This is grass ending exclusive content. Oh, my friend Neil bent over and this happened. <laughs> Oh, that's kind of huge. You just repeat it after him, and it worked. Do it more often. Wait, I, I said he crawled away. Did he really just crawl away? I mean, I didn't even look at his direction. Where? Ex when exactly did you see that? Just now. Person, I didn't hear it. You're just trying to distract me. But I know that my words were shown on the screen. I don't think they actually said that. No. <laughs> I'm standing by the shelves. On the rack, there are bags of milk. Have you ever seen a bag of milk in real life, JD or Ren? Um, I actually I have a bag of milk once. Is it like Canadian or like, yeah, it's Canadian, but also, I don't know, maybe European too. This is very like even Nikki music. We both stand in the milk lies or maybe. This is like yummy Nikki. <laughs> <laughs> yummy Nikki. Hey, don't slow down. Do you remember oh, while you're here? Oh, this guy's not in the milk ending, though. This guy's in the grass ending. <laughs> Take buy milk. So buy it. Right here? What do you expect me to say? Uh, I guess something like, not here. You're getting on my nerves. You're getting on my You're getting nerves. real. You're getting real peeved off. You're getting real hey, peeved buddy. off. What do you think you're doing? Hey, buddy. We can't do this in front of the street, guys. We have to stop <laughs> this now. They don't know. Not here, take the bag and get rid of this I guess the first sentence. Guys, I just, I saved all of you guys from like an entire stream of like, hey buddy, hey buddy, what do you think you're doing? That really hurt there. And, <laughs> hey, not gonna be really, really, really <laughs> I talked about this last stream, it's one of my favorite videos ever. No. <laughs> We're and, as if, and as if you, out of spite, didn't pause before the second one, you want to rob me of my little victories? I said, reach to, over to take uh, the milk, or rather, the bag of the milk inside. Or rather, a bag of milk inside of a bag. Or rather, a bag of milk inside of a bag of milk. Or rather, a bag of milk inside of a bag of milk inside well, of a bag of milk. Guy, shut or rather, up. a bag of milk inside of a bag of milk. It's. <laughs> oh, come on. Fifteen minutes. Oh my God, we've been here for, like for like forty-five minutes. Fifteen minutes. Yeah, the whole discussion closes. really took a long time. Yeah. I remember what these games are called. The visual novels. Shut uh, up. Meta. Just buy the milk, buddy. You need me to send something? Well, I'll see it later. And by the way, the numbers are written in there in full with the numbers are written there in full with letters. Are visual novels worse than books? But there are the authors, are... but there the authors, authors are not lazy, worse so don't get lazy either. Milk. I thought <laughs> I thought only your thoughts were available of this one stream. Not anymore. So watch your mouth. Eh. Um, get milk. I'm on my way. I think we're like crazy. Can I get some milk, please? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You have it. Uh, give. I put a weighty bag on the register. Of course, not just the bag, but the milk, too. Can I have, please? No. Please. No. 
please, mom will throw me out of the window if I get back without yeah. milk. <laughs> out yeah, the now, window. There's, now there's stakes to the story. Oh. No. But why not? Give more. But I don't have anything else. Hey. What? Pay for the milk. I really what I do about you. I see a crumbled bill out of my pocket and it's a cashier. This is like what I look like in real life. That's true. I was like I was a cashier for a corn truck. This is, corn truck. This is what I look like. He starts to carefully examine it. It kind of did sometimes. It took about two days for he nodded contently and put it in the cash register. Thank you. Goodbye. We got the milk ending. Yes. I walk past a familiar street, past a gas station. A bag of milk unpleasantly tugs at my hand, reminding me of the days when I was in physical therapy. By the way, they gave me a bag of milk at the checkout. They gave me a bag at the checkout, so now I'm carrying a bag of milk in another bag. Inception. Oh. Hi, Impex. How you doing? Bye, idiot mania. <laughs> Don't think of anything. Don't think anything of it. I just love the pyramidal, per pyramidal, pyramidal structure of pyramidal. verbal constructions. Pyramidal. The gas station is getting closer. How are you feeling? Thank you for your interest. I feel like a mile-long bar of ice cream. <laughs> what? What's that supposed to mean? What? I don't know. As if I tell you. So <laughs> you're a weirdo. <laughs> I'm sharing a view and you. I feel movement under my feet. Asphalt grains, petrol stains. Grass? I'm trying to keep my balance, and how do people move over something as uneven as a city plain? Gently, heel toe, I count in my mind every meter of the path I walk. I even close my eyes. You're gonna walk into the grass, buddy. <laughs> no, oh my god. <laughs> good, good morning, stream. Good, good morning. morning. Hey, hey, watch out. Huh? They're about to get uh, run over. Oh, we're gonna get the grass and then the grass is gonna run me over. A huge... Right. Unconsciously take a step to the side at the same moment, a huge bear rushes past me. Hey, I'm walking here. Hey, I'm walking here. I cast a reproachful glance at the swiftly departing giant. Its red eyes in turn look me in mockery. Did you see that? How brazen. It was a truck. Oh. Oh. We're crazy. <laughs> Oh, really? Although, if you think about it, are there bears with eyes on the back of their heads? Maybe. You could have died. Come on, are you saying someone would seriously want to kill an innocent girl carrying a bag of milk? Would you date a girl that sounded like this? Like, hello, I'm... I'm girl. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, maybe I would. Uh, the world is a cruel and dangerous place. I'm not in the world you're thinking about. Oh yeah. We're in the in the fake world. My journey continues. If you think about it, the road from the store has one interesting property. It adjusts to me in the most bizarre ways. When I'm in a hurry, all the traffic lights turn off helplessly. Helpfully. When I feel like crying, a cloud of appears over me and pours rain streams that hide my tears. It's like um it's like that one uh, corn plate movie. True. Right now, I can feel a cloud slowly gathering over the top of my head. I'm sad. Are you sure this is really happening? What else could it be? Has it ever occurred to you that it's all in your head? That's not what the manual said at all. Apparently, these pills don't work for me either. The pills have nothing to do with it? I don't think there's bears with eyes on top of the head. At the back of the head? Um, well, um... You just need to go exploring more, you know? Mm -hmm. Please, I just want to go, uh, get home. They don't know about the, uh, the creatures of the world. They don't know about the bear ending. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> go to bed. I really, really am very grateful to you, but please, no more. You know what? What? Since I'm a character in a visual novel, I want to talk to whoever is reading this right now. Oh, me, that's me, guys! That's me, that's me! Look out, this is gonna be the name drop. Can you show what idiot said? No, uh, I will, I will, uh, when I'm not busy gaming. <laughs> you got <laughs> Yeah, Mpix, you just touch grass. Okay, if you say so. I forcefully squeeze my head with my hands and place a thought block. 
of the corner of my eye, I notice a small bench, the perfect place for a cliched visual novel monologues. Oh, Move closer, place a noticeably weighted bag of milk next to it, and raise my head to the sky. Turns on face camera. It's a very, <laughs> very nice guy. Listen, I'm a little embarrassed, haha. <laughs> I realize that I'm going crazy, the medications are becoming less and less effective, so... Ultimately, things will happen painlessly, I hope. Do you know what I'm talking about? Uh... Oh. Uh, I, I... have never... Oh... <laughs> taken medication like for like that. I hope you feel better. I can't, uh... Yeah. <laughs> I'll be honest with you, and I expect the same from you, please. Do you know what I'm talking about? I think so. Um, yes. Really? I must be nothing like the model pro pro protagonist at all, huh? To be honest, I haven't read many visual novels. Sometimes I forget it, because now it costs me a lot of effort just to distinguish between letters and words. By the way, if you don't mind, I'd rather not name my diagnosis. Let, uh, let at least you be the one who sees me for who I am. Even though I made you up, don't take that away from me, okay? You're made don't ask me for too much. <laughs> How stupid does this all seem? From the very beginning, you've been following me, reading my delusional thoughts, hearing my silly conversations. Like the O conversation! Oh. I must seem crazy and weird to you. A little. There's a heart right there. Neat. What is it to see the world through my eyes? Ever since something happened, all I see is red. Red blood everywhere. No, don't worry about me. I got used to it a long time ago. Admittedly, I had even forgotten what other colors look like. Come on. It's actually looking all purple right now. It's kind of, it's kind of purple and black too. Those monsters from the store, they didn't scare me at all. After all, I know they wouldn't hurt me. Sometimes I think they, them, they themselves are afraid of me. Can you imagine that? By the way, if you want to ask me what happened, please don't. Promise? Yeah. What happened? <laughs> I'm serious! Oh, I said yeah. I, I, I think I'm supposed to say yes. Of course, you couldn't help but ask. In the end, I'm just talking to it myself. Sooner or later, I would have brought it up. So you're really that interested in what happened to me? Okay. I won't waste time. What do you see? What do I see? IDK. Um, it's, a, it's like a Rorschach test, right? Is that like no or ink block? Ink block. That's the like, same thing, I think. It's the same thing. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Um. What do I see? Uh. Is a pipe? Is a faucet? I can I see a faucet? A faucet? Smell it wrong. Enough fouch it. <laughs> oh, fouchy. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> this is my dad. Oh, oh hi, dad. Okay, my bad. Some is some of his parts at least. We do have a very difficult family, but despite all the problems, I never would have thought. Sorry, I shouldn't have raised my voice. Anyway, he jumped out of the window and died. <laughs> okay. Oh, my bad. My bad. This is my last memory, then a long gap. It's more like dead unreveal. <laughs> strange, very strange. Okay. Today is the first time I've ever been able to buy something in the store without a major incident. Awesome. Of course, the medicine helped me, however. I think it's more your merit. I kept thinking, we must screw up in front of the reader. Oh, oh my god, what will he think? <laughs> I don't know why I decided to become a visual novel character for the sake of going to the store today, but it clearly paid off. Thank you. By the way, it seems to me that there are some boundaries in our communication. That's how I like it, huh? And yet, I've been so there sad lately. Boundary. Ugh. Boundaries. I mean, I guess the boundaries... These boundaries have kind of went away. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was saying. Oh my god, yeah. I've been thinking more and more about what my life has become ever since my dad... Well, you know. Well, after, you know. <laughs> he... Uh, what medicine? Um... They need mental medicine, because they uh, have mental issues. Mental health, mental health, mental Day after day, it's the same thing. I've tried so many medications that I hardly feel any difference between them anymore. As long as they help keep me on my feet, I'm happy. 
But you know what? Today is a special day because I have you! <gasps> Me! This. No! Not this guy! I was very rude of you. I know. I'm not gonna pressure you, I'm just advising you to go home. I understand. Well, dear reader, shall we go? We're going. When I get to the, my floor, I hang over the railing. Oh, uh, don't jump. Repeating this action every day like a ritual, I stopped being afraid of heights altogether. A few minutes ago, the effects of the medicine finally wore off, so I just enjoy the blissful silence. When I'm under the influence of drugs, terrible and unpleasant melodies sound in my head, mixing with the sounds of the world around me. They create a terrible dissonance in my head. I turn around and go to my apartment. Hi, apartment. This guy looks like a... This door looks like a... This guy. Is that a gun? <laughs> oh, what? Whoa, hi. I'm it's the alien! Hey, yeah. kiss him. Whoa. Get your mind, let me look. Did we forget it at the bench? <laughs> Hi, Mom! Did you break the milk? This game is not 10 minutes? Well, I'm a slow reader. It probably is 10 minutes for people that, like, read fast. <laughs> Hi, Mom. Yes, Mom. Okay, we got it, so. Five, Did five your... Jump scare. <laughs> I might I'm scream. Did your medicine help? Yes, mom. Go to bed. Yes, mom. Hi, that's a Freddy jump scare. Oh no. Don't scare me. Five nights at Freddy's. Five nights at Freddy's? Ah! I did no, it! That was the grass ending. I got the grass ending. Okay, there's another achievement we have to get. What is uh called? let's see. It's a hidden achievement. It's uh not this time. You should be mean. This is the mean run. <laughs> you chocolate things. lime. Yeah, you chocolate lime uh, and picks. Ruji, are you still here? I mean, maybe Ruji knows how to get the bad ending. Okay, this is gonna be JD. Think... You're gonna get the bad ending. Oh, you missed a period. <laughs> oh, what? This is not me at all. This is my fake imposter. So shut up and go already. Now you're supposed to help me. Take a breath. Kick my blah blah blah. It's the world more. <laughs> Let's get the secret Ohio ant ending! Yeah! Yay! Grass oh, can I bubble up? See. Careful now. This is the first time you're so stupid. Some salt to me. Here we go again. So. What then? Hopeless. Start closes. Very, very guilty. Because mom will be bad! It's the guy! I know this guy. Oh, can you say let's what? Oh, let's Excuse me, what? <laughs> what? Excuse me, what? Excuse me, what? <laughs> Excuse me, what? Excuse me, what? Let's write the mechanism. Excuse me. Uh, once again, Oily puts his image on our stream. Yeah, I, I, that's gonna be double banned. No, I'm sorry for good seeing everybody. Are you? I'm no, he's one. not sorry. That's what I thought. He doesn't even know what sorry means. What does sorry mean? What's the definition of sorry? Go to Urban Dictionary right now. Sorry is a game you can play with two to four people. Yeah. Oh, <gasps> cards. Get out of my nerves. You're getting money. Oh! What'd you do? Looks like JD doesn't <laughs> help me at all. <laughs> oh. JD! My bad. I, I, I'm, I was, I just went mean route, and I got it. My bad. I guess I'll try something else next time! My bad. Oh, okay. Hey, we're it? done. That's did you it. get the achievement? Yeah, I did, I did. Ren, Ren. No, we're not doing the, oh, I hope <laughs> we're not. Better than Whoa, what the heck? Oh, this is, a uh, like, visual novel stuff, cool. Oh, uh, yes. I hope you can do better than JD. Don't you worry. You're sweet little ad. <laughs> okay, Ren. We'll, we'll name you Ren <laughs> in the, the sequel. That was milk inside of a bag of milk. Now we're going to play milk outside of a bag of milk. I need to get that ready. Up. I have a but knife. Else, 
Oh my, you do right now? Oh yeah, you're like, you're carving stuff right now. I have a knife. I've never used this knife before. Also, uh, Idiot Media wa wanted me to show this. <laughs> Thanks, Idiot Media. This is very good. Yeah, Foil, Foil is just like the, uh, it's just the guy that shows up when there's no, like, screen to show. Foil is my, uh, my Furby counterpart. Uh, you should, uh, shake his hand. Yay, shaking, shaking. Nice to meet you. Thanks, JD! He said hi. He said thank you, JD. Oh, awesome. Yeah, that was him. Uh, goaded? <laughs> it's kind of goaded. There you go. Here it is. Let me stream it for you guys in the uh, Discord. It's the the language is back. It's I love the aesthetic of milk outside of a bag. It's comforting. Interesting. Okay. I I I've, I've seen screenshots of milk outside of a bag, like of the uh, the character we play. Let's hop right in. Like I know uh, someone in, on Twitter that I follow has a, a profile picture of a. Oh, there's not a character. There's not flashing images. Ah, uh, flashing images. That would be topics. Oh. No. Find you, Bob. Oh. We're oh I gotta get my deck sucked. Game. What? Ooh. Oh wow. Whoa. Okay. It's real. Yeah. So glad we moved on to this stuff instead of that garbage retro pixel. This is very cool looking. This is a big upgrade. Oh, they're counting their steps. They're doing it. Yeah, that's a reference. Yeah. What the fuck? Wow. Store is closing soon. I love how they like count their steps. That's so neat. That's not a bag. Do you count your steps? That's... No. I just step. Oh, she got the crazy eyes. Can I have it? Can I have it? Oh. Oh, Marty, what about the milky? Can I have it? Oh, Marty want milky. Mm, Mario's milky. Oh, Mario, you got a bag of milky, time. Mario? What do you see? Oh, is this like a rehash of the first game? Are you sure? I think it is. I think or like I think more. We're getting like the scenic route. Yeah, it's the grass ending. Yeah. A bag is a state of mind. <laughs> it's get a bag Tuesday. Why is there Mario and Luigi on stream? Oh, they're just the guys. Mario, I gotta go to get the bag of milk. We're gonna see mom. Yes, mom. Wait, what is that fucking from? That, it looks like the even Galleon like face. Oh it God, it kind of does. Is. I think it's just like styled like that. Let me actually lower the volume for me. But raise it for you guys. Continue. He has a nice guitar. Okay, continue. Or oh, new game actually. She did the apex twin face. That might be it. The eyes. I'm walking to my room. Try not to look around. Play. Maybe. Oh, maybe the intro was a a recap. Yeah, that's what I was what saying. I said. You did? Oh, I didn't yeah. hear you. <laughs> I responded to it! <laughs> uh, playful shadows dance around me here and there. They d dash all over the walls, the ceiling. One of those shadows whizzes past me, touching my face ever so slightly. I smile and continue walking, paying it no mind. Sometimes it's easy to lose self-control and track of time, spinning in a joyful dance. Oh yeah, that happens to me sometimes. I, mean, I do that a lot. I actually, I, sometimes like, I uh, pace around my room for an hour. And then I realize, oh shit, I have to do work. And then I do work for like 15 minutes and I, I do the pace around my room for an hour again. Yeah, I feel that. But well, I'm a bit of a hurry here. Mom told me to go to bed. Yeah, that's I'm gonna me. listen to mom. Sometimes I'm in a bit of a hurry because mom told me to go to bed. Oh, the shadows. I walk past the kitchen on my way to room. The door is shut, but I can feel the chilling air coming from the other side. My first thought is that there's a living corpse blowing through the keyhole, laughing mock mockingly. 
That's so silly. I'm sure we have absolutely no kitchens in our corpses. Our corpses in our kitchens. <laughs> I know for sure that we have never had any corpses in our sure kitchen. I know for sure we've never had any corpses in our kitchen. I'm oh, absolutely oh, sure. Oh. More likely than you that think. I think they've had corpses in our kitchen. I break into a run and dash towards the closed door. The shadows intensify their chaotic dance. Are they trying to stop me or calm me down? I don't know. It doesn't matter right now. Don't you get it? Don't you get it? It's like a, <laughs> when don't you go to the bathroom at night know. and like you have to close the door. And yeah. like go to your room as fast as possible. I leave my it hands around as I run, trying to chase away my annoying pursuers. But then I suddenly realize that I won't be able to stop in time. I've got no other choice but to break the door now. If there's someone inside, I'll surely scare them to death. But wait, how can I scare to death someone who's already dead? But what if it actually revives them? No, I don't want that. I don't want that. No, 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 what, no, I, what do no. I do? No, 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 no. I couldn't complete fully my thought when I sh my shoulder hit the door and it flew open. Oh. <gasps> Me I'm too. <laughs> As I expected, there were no living corpse inside. But there was a bag of milk I bought today sitting right in the middle of the table, watching me with its unblinking eyes. Erm... Um, eyes? <laughs> Milks don't have eyes! I stare back, nothing happens. Although, what exactly did I expect? Gratitude? Have I done something that warranted it? A bag of milk probably doesn't care whether it's on a shelf or in a store or on a table in my mom's kitchen. If I was a bag of milk, I would care. I would kind of care. Man, I, I did the first game. This is the we're just playing now. On the other hand, nobody would drink milk inside the store, which means I took it from the safest place in the world and into the scary unknown. I'm so sorry, you you poor thing. Oh, I just realized the I are moving to the left. The I are moving. The, I the IRS? <gasps> I turn away in shame and leave the door. Leave the room in hurry. I can only bring others trouble. I walk toward my room, toward a narrow corridor. Or through a narrow corridor. Oh! Uh -oh. Hi, Mom. Is this Mom? Hey, Mommy. <laughs> Hi, Mommy. I meet a familiar, formless creature Mom. at the door. Maybe. I'm a big fan of this flashing visual. It locks me in clutches and starts sniffing every inch of my body like a hungry dog. By the way, if you have like epilepsy issues, um, I would uh, look away from the stream Fair warning. during this like part. Said that. I, I did. Oh, the game said that, but like I, I need to say it first, you know. Mm -hmm. I'm not struggling. I know it's useless. I just stay silent and endure its tight grip that stops me from moving. Very cool guitar music. Mom. Oh, I think, yeah, it is mom. Be. You're right, you're Hi, right. Mom. After sniffing me from head to toe, does your mom sniff you? The creature holds out its bad. ugly paws, yeah. barring a single claw, thin and sharp like a blade. Again! I stare questioningly into the monster's bottomless eye sockets. Mm. Don't move! The creature squeezes my hands until veins start bulging, and I just keep staring into the black cavities where its eyes should be, ignoring all pain. I promise so many times! Stay put! Ugh. <laughs> the moment it says that, its claw pierces my arm. I don't feel anything other than the barely discernible crawling under my skin and the ring of its tightly sprung... Sinews? Sinews. Sinews. But then the claw injects its venom into me. Oh, It hurts. <laughs> wow, Mom, did you put on eyeliner? <laughs> Damn. Damn. A white veil appears in front of my eyes. My fingers cramp and start twitching frantically. I lose control of my body and slowly slide to the floor, just like last time, but... Why do I feel so high? I feel my blood boiling up. Strong shivers run through my body, paralyzing every single cell. While my veins and arteries heat up, almost bursting from that pressure. I try screaming! <gasps> but instead of producing words, I th vomit... Vomit. Thick, milky foam. Oh, we drank the milk. It was bad. The creature notices it and throws itself at me in anger, grabbing me by the throat while keeping the poisonous claws inside my arm. Kill me! Kill me! Hysterical screams resonate through the corridor, or resound. In a fit of madness, the creature starts scratching my neck. Bright splashes fly everywhere, hitting the walls with a loud sound. I can't believe I got the bad ending already. I don't know if this is the bad <laughs> ending, because you, you haven't even had a chance to do anything. 
Mm, uh, it's the bad ending. I oh, tried yeah. to run print <laughs> where every drop fell in my memory so that I could gather them all later. I need to remember. I need to. A new wave of pain washes over me. Everything turns pitch black in an instant. I like that fade out effect. Yeah. <laughs> the game. <laughs> the game understood the difference between poison and venom, and then it didn't. <laughs> it is bothering Mpix. Say it. I'll never drink milk again ever again. Hi. Say it. I'll never drink milk ever again. Say it again. I'll never drink milk ever again. I'll never drink milk ever again. Oh, we just wanted the sippy. You're just having the goldfish milk. Yeah. We're back to normal, I think. I finally get to my room. I'm so tired of all this fuss. Thankfully, I feel comfy and warm inside my room. Even the weird noises coming from the outside don't make me anxious at all. This is a neat perspective. It is. It's a very nice Arsha. She's cute. Mom told me to go to bed, so I need to perform all the needed preparations. I've washed my face, and now I'm standing in front of the mirror with a toothbrush in my mouth. She's so cute. Why don't you marry her? Um, okay! <laughs> Where's that from? Oh, uh, that's from, like, from Diary of Wimpy Kid. <laughs> okay! <laughs> it's just, like, from grade school. I look at my reflection. It shows absolutely no desire to sleep. You know, I get how you feel. You know you could drink venom and be fine? What? That I guess it, as long as it goes into, like, your blood stream. I, I guess venom hurts your blood. Any Benum. poison, you can't drink it. Benum. It's oh my god! It's like the it's like the guy! It's like the guy! And there is a time when the last minutes before I sleep were my favorite time of the day. I love anticipating the inevitable moment when the reality in the dream world would clash. <clears throat> I woke up for that moment's sake, lived through the day for it. My biggest dream was to sleep all day long. Uh, excuse me, <laughs> it, it would have been so cool. But the dreams always slowly but surely slipped away. What was the... Uh, what was the longest you've ever slept? Oh, uh, Not that long, probably. I've no, I've at least slept for like at least more than 18 hours before. Well, or like 16. A rowing competition, I went there. I We got off the boat, I threw up, and then I went in the car. I fell asleep. And then, I don't know, like maybe like... Maybe two days passed. Two days? Holy Not shit! Days, but I woke up very briefly, then I just went back to sleep. Oh. Uh, as if someone horrible. fished them out of my hand, one after another, one after another, until nothing was left. And now I have to sleep again, even though I don't feel any need, any need for it. 13 hours once. That's pretty long. Sometimes you just feel really eepy. I'll pick up the pill bottles. A fucking limp pill bottle. Yeah, look I know, at right? the pill bottle. The pill. I like the pill bottle on the front. It's doing like a stance. I like the Mario <laughs> coin pill bottle. Oh, what's that noise? That's right. Like, your, your, your mic is warping. mixing up. Your I'm mic is a. My mic. Ren, your mic is. <laughs> <laughs> Ren is the <laughs> Mickey. Oh, what's up? Your mic was a uh, uh, messing up. I think it's fine Weird. then. Now. That's fine now. Okay. Oh, wait, my, my fucking phone was on my microphone. I was balancing it so I can get a better view. I think that was why, yeah. Okay, sorry about that, folks. If real life had achievements, what would they be? Um, it's the gamer question of the year. Um, probably Beat Sands. That's one of them. Being this famous? Dog knows all, this dog knows new tricks. Teach a dog a new trick. That's a good. That's a good achievement. After finishing with my face, I usually reach up for my pills. It's funny, but I have no idea how they work separately since I always swallow them as a bunch without thinking. Maybe you shouldn't do that. Maybe you should, like, one by one, right? I think that's how you do it. Uh, that's... Well, you're, you're one to talk. Don't you eat, like... Don't you, like, throw a big batch of Skittles in your mouth at once? That's true, but that's different. <laughs> Is it really? No. Uh, are Skittles actually just pills for little kids? They teach them how to eat pills. No, you chew this on the- This is a chew conspiracy. <laughs> Do we- Okay, hold on, are you telling Marshall. me you just swallow them? A the handful No, them? but sometimes maybe you can the swallow them, I don't know. Left what is, is your gag? Like, 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 <laughs> the woke liberal left controls Skittles. They're training <laughs> our children to eat pills. 
Why do you think it's rainbow, huh? Oh, oh, and then, yep, it's all coming together. Being famous is a, it's a life achievement, yeah, that's why I gotta be Trump famous. Trump dreamed you know? of a Skittle-free nation, and they silenced him. They silenced <laughs> True. him. True! They're arresting him! Oh, now <laughs> I want to have a better look at it, to twirl it between my fingers, to chew on it. Oh. I do anything to stall, just for a little bit more time. A smooth, protruded red capsule is looking at me. It's covered by, it's covered in a murky, semi-transparent film, but I can still discern its content, its contents. So what do we have inside you? This is me after I like, uh, eat a burger. Yeah, this is like, you after your big night out. Yeah. I gently press on the capsule from both sides and, to my surprise, it turns out to be soft and squishy. I press harder and the capsule pops. Sticky, bright oh liquid, liquid pops what out. Oh my god, what did you expect? Filthy, filthy! You're the pill flies editing, straight to the waste bin and I start rigorously washing my hands. There's no way I'm drinking that! Next was a flat pill of the same blood red color. There were some letters printed out on it. Oh, I get it. This is the medicine that makes me really sleepy, but it's not the type of sleep I want. That's not it at all. It's fake. No, 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 no. I don't want to look at it. The pill flies into the waste bin as well. Oh, you should probably take your pills. What a waste. <laughs> the, next ha the next half hour goes by in a similar fashion. I study every pill from all sides, and then I find a reason not to swallow it. I invent my own medicine instead, and enjoy swallow them one after another, letting myself drown in their healing effects. <laughs> Sleepy, <laughs> Sleepy Joe's pants busted the seam, and all the skills came came out. Uh huh. He's actually, you know, like you know, Oogie Boogie. What's Oogie from, Boogie? From a nightmare, from a nightmare before Christmas. JD, I have a confession. I've never actually seen that movie. Oh, this what does he look like? Guy. Um, okay. He looks like a kind of like a big sack with holes for for eyes and mouths come out and he, with uh, cut out. And you know he uh -huh. has got he's got like a pe uh, arms and legs and stuff. And cool. he's full of bugs. And like he's the bugs. <gasps> he's he's like the a bugs. Piece of entity, but the bugs make him up. That's like what's oh, cool. the thinking. It's like that. Joe Biden is like that, but with Skittles instead. <laughs> He's the Skittles. Yeah. My hand doesn't hurt anymore. Hey, my head doesn't hurt anymore. Hey, my heart doesn't hurt anymore. Hey, my stomach doesn't hurt anymore. Hey, my eyes don't hurt. How come this I this didn't think of this earlier? Like a YouTube poop. It kind of does. JD, when you just said these pants were going to rip out, I thought you were like, going to say like, his nuts would fall out or something <laughs> disgusting. <laughs> his Skittle nuts. He has two no. big skills for nuts. I don't want to taste the rainbow. No, 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 oh, no, no. You're going to have to. This is so simple. I need to brag about it to someone right away. I love placebos. But not to my mom. She'll just scold me. And she's sure I'm already sleeping in her anyway. I don't want to disturb her without reason. I'll think of something myself. Besides, I really want some small task talk. I wonder who's going to be my conversation partner. Me, 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 me. I will talk to you. You're being accused of making weed skittles, lol? Hi, uh, hey. Hey? Ooh, nice room. Oh no, all the takeout. Oh no, 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 no. Damn, girl, you got the uh, you got the seven of cups going on your desk? You got the er it, mark the er seven hey, long office mark. <laughs> <laughs> it's a nice room, kinda. Hey, know, long time no see! Shit. Um, we're only supposed to meet Wait, once a day? This, really? Is this us I'm looking at right it's now? It's us now, yeah. Okay, who are we? Hasn't been an hour, dummy. There you go, bullying me again! Aren't you even a little bit happy? Not even the slightest bit! Are you going for the bad ending right now? No, I'm gonna go for the good ending. I'm pretty exhausted after today. Well, I guess you are too. That's not true! I'm gonna go to bed. No! You've been in control for way too long already! It's my turn now! Alright! I'll just stay silent until the medicine's effects were off. How about that? Hey, you can't do that! You need to do your best to make me feel better! Exactly what I'm doing. What a bully. Actually, why am I even worried about this? In reality, I don't need you at all! Huh? I'm so energetic and I feel great, which means I can do anything! And you, you can only watch and agonize over your uselessness! Hey, I can imagine how angry you are right now. What make you so happy all of a sudden? And why would I be sad? 
<laughs> I do like your shirt. It's just Arr! It's like uh the knight in the woods character. Oh Kai, yeah, right? Uh I think May has the same shirt, hey. right? These also could be like tissue boxes. Or like I don't know, maybe she bleeds a lot. Uh, or, uh not, not in that way. Um in the uh, what did I mean by that? It's like, uh, <laughs> you're the Isaac Fax guy. It's like the Isaac uh, description for Lead You don't like where you actually shoot seven leader. tiers instead of six tiers. <laughs> True? <laughs> Does it? That's such, a, that's such a stupid fact because it's like comparing it to nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Remember yourself a couple hours ago? The, the I don't know what you mean. The whole sentence instead of six tiers is like completely irrelevant. <laughs> Stop lying, JD. Oh, my bad. No, I don't. I still don't understand. Whatever. Unlike Whoa, you, what I don't that? forget. The screen just flashed for a second. Did you see that? I, it was a little laggy for me for a bit, but yeah. I don't forget that pathetic, snotty girl for a long time. She just whines and whines all the time. Don't even try ruining my mood. I want to have fun while while we're together, okay? So you're the one calling all the shots now? Yeah. Well, let's see how long it can last. We'll see. Yeah. All right. Am I really that pathetic? Say something! You feel tears streaming down my cheeks, hanging through my chin, and falling on my clothes, burning holes in them. The Binding of Isaac? She is like, Bernie tears. She has fire mind? Sulfuric acid. That was fast, but not unexpected. Fire mind only explodes 20% of the time. <laughs> <laughs> she, she throws all the pills in her mouth, it's like, bad gas, pheromone, uh, experimental <laughs> pill. Why are we all- why are we getting fecal funny here? Fecal funny? See, he said bad gas. Oh. Hey, at least I tried. Go wash your face, then we'll decide what to do with you. Didn't you already? Wash it again! Do it again! Oh, yeah. I'm in front of a mirror again. I keep staring at my reflection, trying not to get distracted by the sneery looks on the walls. But the sneery looks the walls are giving me. Try not to drown in their giggling. But then me in the mirror also shows a creepy smile, bears her teeth at me. I shut my eyes, but that doesn't help. It wouldn't have helped even if I slunk through the floor. I start counting in my mind. Two squared by two squared, a square squared, square pyramid squared, pyramid squared of YouTube poop dialogue. I feel better. Swows. <laughs> my mom calls Isaac the banding of Isaac. He's in the big band. Come on, guys, we gotta band together to kill Mega Satan. Yeah. Oh yeah. High five. Did you know um, um a mother actually shoots out the thirty four Isaacs? You... Ren, Ren, let's stand with our backs together and both our arms are crossed and we look at the camera. Yo, someone should draw that. I thought you were gonna say like we're gonna put our backs together and we're gonna make sure we will never kill us because we have all sides <laughs> covered. My head's splitting apart now. I started being rude. That's not your fault. It's never your fault. Fine, you can keep blaming yourself, but don't ever do it. I don't know why, but I thought I'd be able to take control. I was almost ready to. I was sure I'd be able to change something. After all, I was still be always able to buy milk, you know. Yeah, you ought to know how challenging it was. Are you a weed man? Maybe. I wouldn't. I wouldn't like no be way. surprised if you smoked weed in real life before Olympics. Or after. Oh, that or reminds later. me. I had a really weird dream last night. I just. Oh, what was your dream? Right I had a dream that I was reading like like a detailed like corporate guide on what to say and what not to say to someone who's high. <laughs> I feel like this is because like we were watching the uh, the grape engine video too much. Yeah. It's like the video to like not show someone while they're high. Yeah, and, the, and 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 contained like special words, like made up words you could say to someone to make them do <laughs> things in their head. If you use this word, it will easily soothe the person you're trip sitting. Literally, literally, it was like um, and they were just like made up words, like gabazooey or whatever. <laughs> gabazooey, gabazooey, gabazooey. So you threw away your medicine. And it was what like a, a corporate, decision, right? like looking like PSA guide. Undoubtedly, more so, it's dangerous. I know. And you keep pushing me. Why do you do that? I felt like I'd be able to fight it on my own. It's true, the pain subsided for a bit at that time, but now I feel it triple in force. It hurts so bad. Just drink your medicine. No, don't abandon me. Please, don't leave us. Sorry. Sorry, Isaac. 
Now, oh, what's this character? Does this character have a name? I wonder. I don't know. Uh, I don't think we've seen it if they have. Yeah. Maybe maybe we'll learn. Dejected. Dejected. I reach out from the shelf with my medicine. I swallow the pills one after another, chasing away the unpleasant pill. visions. Locked down. <laughs> tears up. Tears down. Floating away my memory. And yet, my mind still draws a terrifying picture. Lumps of coagulated blood and transparent coating travel down my esophagus, scratching its soft walls, leaving behind furrows. I shake my head violently. I don't care if it makes me dizzy or worsens my pain. I just don't want to think about something so repulsive. You still haven't changed. What do you mean? You're afraid of being alone. This worries you much more than being painful. Than being than pain. Yeah, I guess. I toss the last pill in the air and catch it in my mouth. Nice. I, I wouldn't be able to do that. She has some skills. Gold. She has like no pillows in her bed. Yeah, I, is she. It looks like she's just laying on a rug. She might actually. Yeah, oh, you're right. <laughs> I lie on the floor. I look at the ceiling. I can clearly hear water running into the metal pipes up there. I hear the crackling of concrete blocks that were someday surely fall on my head. That's the spirit. But I'm not afraid of that at all. Are you like? Have you ever been afraid of like your ceiling fan f like falling on you? Um. Okay. This so I actually have a magnetic disco ball above my chair right now. Bullshit! Fucking take a picture. Of it really? Right now. Uh. Yeah. Sure. You show it. Show it it's for the stream. Small one. I'm making it sound much more impressive than it is, but uh. It hangs above my chair like the sword of Damocles. This shit, the disco kid. <laughs> Chaya's having a weed court right now. We're, they're all like blaming Impix for being a weed. I would have, uh, I would have put it in my locker, but I never use my locker. So, did you uh, send it already? Oh no. Uh, no, I'm, uh, I, I'm taking the. I just took the picture. I'm on my phone. Like I had to get out my phone. This picture is very yellow because it was aimed at the ceiling light, but it's small. Yeah, that's what I was saying. I was I told you it's not big. I didn't know it'd be that small though. Here's JD's. Oh, it's designed to fit ball. in the locker. So, can you shine a light at it? What? Can you shine a light at it? Uh, yeah, but it probably won't do very much. I think I think she would like the disco ball above here. It's not a, it's not a true disco ball. <laughs> there you go. She has it on her. <laughs> Oh, did you if you see to see the stream, it's just on her now. Oh, awesome! Sometimes when I'm like swinging stuff around, I accidentally knock it down and it falls on me. Yeah, I'm not afraid of that at all. I can't imagine my death coming from above. Rather, it's rearing claws from somewhere below, waiting to see me lose focus. I'm just laying. Five Nights at Freddy's jump scare. <gasps> Do you want to talk about it? <laughs> Good pickup. No, I've had enough talking. So aren't we pick. supposed to go to sleep? Yeah. What do you want then? I just want to lie down for a bit. I'll show it later, uh, Idiot Mania. Even the ceiling's bound to collapse, it won't it won't be today. Can you stay silent, please? I just need to get my thoughts in order. I am your thoughts! <laughs> no, no, no I not. I like this shot a lot. It's cool, yeah. I carefully extract my thoughts that are yet to be fully formed in my head and lay them out on the ceiling in orderly rows. Now it's my corkboard. In hopes of seeing the whole picture, I switch them from one place to another, pile them on top of each other, scatter them around. In the end, I throw them off with my hand, annoyed, and start over. I can't do it. You always can imagine. You always can imagine your thoughts as something small Good idea. and swarming. That's like something. You, that's definitely something you say to someone who's high. Yep. Like cockroaches. Imagine your thoughts are like cockroaches. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I hate cockroaches. Can I make them fireflies? Yeah. Oh, my new the way. Yeah, it has to be cockroaches specifically. <gasps> oh yeah. Whoa. Oh yeah. Damn. How they? I didn't know they. I had hate cockroaches in real life too. 
they suck. They don't, their least favorite bug are cockroaches. What's your favorite bug? Um, uh, I like roly polies. Oh, roly polies. I'm a big spiders fan, personally. I'm like, oh, I should probably... Those spiders are just... arachnids, technically. Spiders are pretty good, too. Have. Spiders I like because they eat the flies. We have a common goal. I, oh, actually, I think mosquitoes are the worst bug, actually. Oh, yeah, mosquitoes yeah, those are, are just wild. Un, no, those are just... Cockroaches aren't, aren't hurting anyone. Yeah. They're just weird and gross. I don't have time to think. I haven't had to blink before my thoughts. They're fireflies now. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks for clarifying. <laughs> Start swirling all around over the ceiling of their own accord, forming whimsical patterns. I can only observe them and wait for the right moment. It's just that the moment doesn't come. The mocking sounds of flapping wings coming from the ceiling makes me start makes me start losing my patience. Right now, if I hate you. <laughs> nice. You have rocks in your pockets? Why? Do you like throw them at people? I spring to my feet and scream at the top of my lungs. The fireflies scatter. Good job, Master Ogre. No way! Unstable behavior makes you look bad. I don't give a damn! So it doesn't bother you? Should it? No. A lot of people act like this. Really? There's nothing, there's nothing shameful about snapping at someone, if you have reason for that. If you could stop it, you'd have a reason, didn't you? Um, someone being like yourself? <laughs> you surely get better, believe me. And now start over. I like how they say dot dot dot. You're like, <laughs> dot dot dot. You're at it again. What do you mean? Never mind. And I have changed my mind anyway. Please don't say sil stay silent for this long anymore. I'm having a hard time without your help. Dot dot dot. Fine. I raise my eyes to look at the ceiling once more. Sadly, all my fireflies seem to be hiding somewhere. I need to find them. Um. Dot dot dot. You glance around the room, there are too many places for a creature as small as a firefly to hide here. They can be anywhere. Suddenly I hear a, de a deafening rumble. The clock just hit midnight. <gasps> it's so late already, but I can't go to bed right now. Will you help me? Please, tell me you'll, you'll help me. Dot, dot, dot. Come on, stop bullying me. You promised to talk to me. What are you thinking about lying on the floor? What are you thinking while lying on the floor? What do you mean? You should know it better than anyone else. I have no idea. Tell me? Hi. Uh. Oh. Oh. Um. I roll my sleeves and start rubbing my eyes intensely. They're so itchy. Why are you crying? Oh, uh, why are you crying? <laughs> my eyes are itchy. Did you drink milk? You... There was another option. Yeah, there was. Did you bring milk? Mm -hmm. I wonder if I tear all my eyelashes one after another when I stop itching. I wonder if I tear out all my eyelashes one after another. All my eyelashes one after another. If I tear off all my eyelashes all after another. What have you done? I need to gather the glass and then and then I take a bath and then here drink some milk. No! First death. That's the achievement I got. Good job. Okay. I stand in the middle of my room, my mouth agape, gasping for air. I think I just experienced death. <laughs> I don't it's like a know. rogue like. <gasps> I don't know any oh other way God. to explain what happened. Oh, a rogue like. Well, that's surely something. Did I go to sleep? Will you tell me or not? About what? Oh, okay, we just had a moment. All right. Sometimes it happens. Look, look, look let's look for fireflies instead. You're acting weird. Help me instead of running your mouth. I've already had enough adventures before bed. I need to gather my thoughts quickly and go to bed. And my thoughts are hiding from me. Hee! I don't I have no idea where to look for them. Me neither. I guess we'll have to tear the whole place apart. No, 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 and no! Even I make the smallest messes of here, I'll feel really bad. All the things should stay in their places, and that's it. Why? 
All the takeout boxes that you haven't thrown away. Uh, you trying to come up for a reason right now? Oh, me? Of course not! Whoa, who? Me? <laughs> who, me? I'm going to bring your forehead. I think you forgot to put up your mind block. Oh, your mind block. Your chakras. See, right? I can see through you. Yeah, bad comms. I can see Rude. with my third eye. <laughs> <laughs> your milk has been spoiled. All right, then. So we need to find a bunch of tiny insects inside a mountain of junk without moving anything even an inch? Yeah. My, oh, my. I have an idea! Last time, becoming a visual novel character helped me achieve my goal. Now I want to become a point-and-click adventure character! Oh, hey! Really? Sure. Yeah, that's cool. You know, those games have moments where you just look at different objects and something inevitably happens. It sounds so fun! And what about the things you, you use regularly? Do you refuse to touch them as well? It would make even more- it would make even it even more interesting! So childish. And want to know what's the best part? You'll be the one doing it! Yippee! Oh, yes! Oh, yes! <laughs> I start panicking as soon as I get into multiple choice situations. I'll just keep changing my mind and end up crying and running away. Do you want that to happen? You're such a handful. Do you want? Go in the middle of the room and look around. Where would I hide it? Where would I hide it if I were a tiny firefly? My heart gets warmer from the pleasant anticipation. Hey. What? Look down. Look down. After a moment, a small ball of light... And warmth crawls under from my sweater. Ooh. Wowie! Wowie! <laughs> this is such oh, a vibe. Yeah. Oh, She's yeah. a low functioning citizen on the 18th floor of an apartment complex in the dystopian rural. dystopian town of Moscow in the year 2020XX. We're 100 years in the. To 200 years in the future, apparently. <laughs> For you. Uh, that's what you said. I carefully grab the firefly. It's pleasantly scorching to the touch. I put it on my shoulder. I'm sorry, little guy. Time to come home now. As if it was an order, the firefly slowly drifts up, circles my around my head for a bit, and flies into my ear with the speed of a bullet. He tickles! One down looks for the others. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, photo mode. They just do that. Oh, the point and click adventure game now. Okay, I can't look at that. No, you Let's should. Look at that. I can't click it. Oh, epic fail. Uh, is that a sleeping bag? I don't even have a bed. Okay. Uh, there's an AC. I look up towards a very high place under my ceiling. I can hear a countless numbers of small legs marching inside the AC unit. Is this the air oh, conditioning wow. music? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it is. What happened? Fireflies can be friends with cockroaches. We better look somewhere else. Why would cockroaches be there? Have you, have you forgotten? You were the only one. You were the one who told me to think of my thoughts as cockroaches. Yeah, but... I become fireflies afterwards, but cockroaches don't disappear like that. They, they, so they occupied this place. Do you understand now? Sure, I do. There's a difference between real cockroaches and cockroaches with thoughts, you know? What's this? It's not easy to get out of here. Hey. Okay. So what's inside this, the notebook pages? Your usual notebook pages glued to, glued to the wall with duct tape. Numbers are drawn on them. It's the only kind of information I can take in without trouble. Dosage and side effects? Yeah. I thought you knew them by heart. Yeah. This is not your handwriting, is it? Of course it's not. Shaking broken lines, ugly numbers, it's not handwriting, more like claw marks. Don't forget to thank your mom. I don't need your advice. The screen makes the pages rustle restlessly. After a, moment, a firefly appears from underneath the one of them. Oh, After yeah. looking around in a business-like manner, it takes off into a business-like flight and ends up <laughs> entering my business-like ear. <laughs> We're Mr. Business! Or Miss Business. You know, that's actually something I was thinking about. You know, st stop right now, or stop or left stop now. Or stop left now. I think that's no. the reason why I like Spamton's dialogue so much. It's that it's, it... kind of humor. Like, look into my eyes, look into my ears, look into my mouth, look into my nose. That's the exact same thing, pretty much. He's, he speaks in YouTube poop, it's awesome. Two times the firepower. 0.5 times the water power. 
It's Mike, the are same you listening? Thing. Hey, let's get you searching. Um, tooth placed. I'll get the noun of pills. Oh, it's pills. Makes me feel dizzy. I don't want oh, to think about pills it. Music. I don't. What's wrong? I almost skipped my dose for today. How reckless! I could have died. <laughs> You'll ultimately die anyway. Oh, you You'll die it. anyway. Yes, but you, cause you ordered me to. Things could have been much worse. Yeah. I heave a, I, I heave a deep sigh. Come closer and extend my hand. Wow, it's warm. The moment those words leave my lips, one of the bottles overturns. Pills rain down from it, <gasps> and along with them, a firefly. <gasps> Pog. After circling above my head a couple of times, it fire, it finally lands in my palm. The firefly rushes up my arm, and upon entering my shoulder, upon reaching my shoulder. Crawl straight into my ear. My mind becomes clearer. Neat. Okay. Can't touch that yet. What's this? I turn my eyes towards an inspicuous shelf near the mirror. There's a glass with a toothbrush sitting, sitting on it. And a small towel is hanging nearby. What a wonderful sight! <laughs> my fireflies are smart and good. They would never get in there. They know about personal hygiene. Looks look somewhere else. Like this uh, cupboard. I tilt my head backwards and almost fall over. The closet is hanging under the ceiling, at least 300 feet off the floor. Are you joking? Even though it's my room, not everything here is for me to use. Whatever. I don't care. Yeah, I don't care at all. Like, totally. And I'm definitely not worried. Not even a little, little bit. Not even a smidgen of a little bit. Not even for a thousandth of a percent. That's not, not, that's how much I don't care. We got a cool person in the chat right here. Yeah. Hey, I'm not even done telling you how much I don't care. From this moment on, I'm ignoring you. <laughs> oh, no, you don't. Then act normal. I have got to get normaler. <laughs> I have got to get That's the moral normal. of this game. What? Plant. At least we take care of plant. Right, insects enjoy pollinating the flowers and stuff like that. Common firefly yeah, behavior. The the music sounds like one shot music. I wonder. I don't. Is this me? I wonder. One shot. <laughs> one shot. I wonder if the was this game made by one person, same person yep. who made the last game. I think it's like a like straight it. ending game like that. Again, I guess. I get closer to the flower shelf. I sniff around. The leaves smell of dust and cardboard and death. You know those plants are long dead, right? Aww. Not sure a dead plant will be able to attract many insects. Well, we kind of, we kind of don't have a choice here, you know. Still, you're right. Let's continue searching. Why don't you just throw them out? Why don't you listen to me at all? No. Nah. Okay. Um, laptop. It might be. Look at my laptop. I am there. <laughs> it's all my friends are in here. I haven't touched it for years, so it's covered with a layer of dust as thick as my finger. A bizarre item. I fear it. Why? It's a long and boring story. Wonderful. Tell me about it. Mm. I insist! I don't remember how it appeared in my room. One of my parents probably brought it here because they couldn't find a better place for it. They didn't prohibit me from using it. On the other hand, they encouraged me to do so. Sure, I've spent my whole days in front of the screen. Games, drawing, engineering, calculator... Engineering calculator? She probably is the type of person to just go on like Desmos calculator and just start putting in numbers. I think she would though. By this, 3D modeling, so much fun stuff to do. Even you, you had amusing hobbies. Yeah, I did before entering the web. Oh huh? no! I imagine this. You're a hamster. Uh, yes. JD, <laughs> you're a hamster. That lives under the ground. You have everything for comfortable living. Did you imagine? Yep. Your analogy is spot on. Okay, imagined. Alright, so you're a hamster that lives under the ground. You have everything for a comfortable living, okay? Okay? Wonderful, and here's the situation. You're a hamster that Okay, I got it. <laughs> yeah. Fine. A firefly slowly crawls out of the laptop's vent grill. I reach for it, it gets on my palm, blinking all the while. I think he's trying to say something. I see that myself, if only I knew what. Because I say, do you want to crack it? I changed my mind. I have absolutely no desire to find out what it wants to say. Pops glowing for a moment after that. And it starts glowing again, as if it's coming back to senses. For some time it's from some time it thinks about the further course of my actions. 
then flies up and dashes into my ear. Continue on searching. I don't. Oh, we can finish. I don't want to finish though. We have a lot to search though. I don't like the implication that something happened to her online. I get close to the waste bin and look Animal inside of jam. curiosity. <laughs> she got animal jammed! No! <laughs> Why is Orly talking to a woman with a uh, uh, shirt now? I am that woman. <laughs> we need a Desmo stream? <laughs> yeah. What can he graph? Oh, God. I um, can imagine I'm anything. I'm gonna make myself in Desmos. Actually, I think we are better off on the right over here, because I don't want to block the text box. Uh oh. <laughs> Transform. Uh, flip. there we go. Um, what? There you go. That's better. Oh, now we're, now we're on her now. Okay. There's nothing here instead. There's nothing here. Inst indeed, no self-respecting firefly would hide in a heap of garbage. Can't get disagree with you here. Okay. Uh, my bed. This is my sleeping <laughs> bag. <laughs> it's soft and warm. I'm sure that no living creature will be able to resist the temptation to spend a minute or two inside. They'd want to dick... Dig deep inside of it with a couple of favorite items. They close their eyes and then... Here they fall asleep. Huh? I gently slap my cheeks to return myself to senses. It's already way past midnight. Usually I'd be sleeping like a log right now, but right now I can't! Let's continue searching. Maybe we'll find something inside. Nah, my thoughts don't have a feature of putting... Uh, don't have a feature of putting to sleep. Quite the contrary, they always cause insomnia, just like tonight. Uh, what? I said searching here is meaningless. Okay. Uh, drawer. I doubt it, all the compartments are locked. What if, though? I don't even want to think about what's inside. Who knows what I'll end up imagining. Okay. What book. about this old book? The sketchbook. Half the pages are blank, which means I'll still be good for a couple of years. You draw that rarely? Why? Isn't that obvious? If I run out of pages, I'll have to buy a new sketchbook. I can't get to the stationery store on foot. I'll have to take the bus. Do you even realize what kind of nightmare that can turn into? Maybe you can ask your mom to buy you one? Buy what? Ask whom? Can't you even form coherent sentences? Don't play dumb. Ask your mom to buy you a notebook. Instead? So you want me to perform a string of actions, but you're tell oh, also telling me to God. do that one instead of another? Then how would I decide which action to take? You're so dyslexic. You're a tough case. You lack like empathy. You're tough as a nutcracker. You're you're an idiot. Is that my fault? Get closer to the sketchbooks. Stepping over the wires, the sleeping bag, the cracks in the lap, laminate, and the window's reflection. The sketchbook is lying on the stool. From my height, it seems like the stool is missing two legs. I squat and look again. All the legs are in place. When will he do the heat stroke stream? Oh, no. that would <gasps> good be idea! Thing. That's a good idea. Will I be able to think of an interesting allegory? Little does he know it isn't. Does I know of what? Little does he know it is not a good idea. It's a good idea, JD. What do you mean? Don't do I would, I would love it. Let's not go there, okay? I stand up and study the sketchbook from, from inches away. Its pages are pure white. The last drawing is buried on, on a previous page, the way it should be. Too bad, I'd love to see it. Maybe next time. A sudden gust of chilly wind breaks in the wound, ruin the room and makes the pages rustle. Oh no! Wait, Shut wait. my eyes. Hold on one second. Um it's telling JD in DMs that no, that's a terrible idea. And then he posts this image. <laughs> that's me what? watching the Heatsburg stream. Oh, look, if, this is, if this isn't convincing, I don't know what is. So if, if you guys don't know, I think Heatstroke is a... What's that one game? It's a desert bus type game. It's a fun but typing adventure. You type. It'd be awesome. I can like type and I can read chat and they'd be like, why are we playing this game? 
<laughs> I love this image, by the way. Just be, just this, be like, of... that. That would be like a, a four-hour stream, if not more. And? No, I'm, I'm, not, I'm, just, I, no I'm, I'm not doubting your abilities. I'm just warning you that you might want to block some time out. I have, I have, I can block some time out. I have all the time in the world. A distinctive sound of pages turning echoes with a headache in my head. I know what's going to happen. The wrestling has stopped, even though the wind is still howling okay, from every direction. All right, bye, Ren. Bye, bye. It's just me now. It's just you. It only should mean one thing. Funny. The notebook is open on the first page. I, I saw you like play Cruelty Squad. It was, it was a lot. That's a it's a good experience. I only know about uh, Gorbino's quest. Oh yeah, Gorbino's quest is a goaded. <laughs> he struggles a game. I thought Oily would just be in a smoldering house, getting delirious, and trying to keep conscious. <laughs> That'd be a good stream. We might like me playing a Minecraft heatstroke stream. Minecraft heatstroke stream? What? Like a, a Minecraft stream with just me being like super like in heatstroke mode, like hot and sweaty. Permanent sweating. desert biome. Yeah. I have to look. I have to wait a little longer. If I wait, open your eyes. No. It's okay. Just do it. No way. I know you're lying. Come down. No. Come down. No, come down. No, come down. No, come down. No. Come down. Fine. Open my eyes and of utmost caution. The notebook is still open in the middle. No drawings, nothing. The pages are pure white. Did I imagine it? I don't know, did you? You're a smart one. Here, here you tell me. Next time, don't close your eyes. What did you... I couldn't finish speaking because the pages started moving again. Don't close your eyes. Don't make me do it. I'm scared. Trust me. The rustling glows, gr glows louder. The rustling grows louder. The pages left up. I can almost see the outlines of drawings on previous pages. No way. Everything in the past should stay in the past. You couldn't convince me. That's it. I'm closing my eyes. Look, 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 look there. A barely visible light. <gasps> A firefly. With every new gust, it becomes brighter and brighter. A firefly. Oh yeah. The wind baby. neatly stops for a moment. The world sinks into perfect silence, but only for a moment. The buzz of those, that the buzz that has always been haunting me fills the surroundings, but it doesn't matter now. Goodness gracious, little boy, you made me so scared. The firefly blinks, flies up, and, my, and enters my ear, buzzing loudly all the way. You had heat stroke once. That sucks. I, have you have you had heat stroke, JD? Uh, me? I don't. I don't think so. No. Uh, when I'm when I'm in the heat, I get uh, it make it makes me angry when it's hot out. <laughs> when it's too hot outside, so I try to get spend red as little time in the, in the in the heat as possible. It just makes me very grumpy. I would rather be very cold than very hot. Well, that makes sense that you've had heat stroke, Funamono, since you're Australian. It would make sense because Australian is like hell place. Oh yeah, because you're uh, you're uh, under there. You're a you're a freak. <laughs> I spend some time looking for the perfect spot on my head, then it buzzes then it's buzzing things down. Phew. You okay? We're not sure we're on time, so let's continue searching. Alright. Uh, backpack. I looked down at my school bag. Worn and worn <laughs> down it's silly! silly. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost screaming of its own uselessness. From another angle, it looks like a full belly. Its contents are also regurgitating, decomposing, and turning into a sticky, a sticky mushy substance. What a cool image. I need to remember this. Uh, totally not cool. Seems senseless and cruel. You are there, but I don't care. Is it me you're laughing at? What? I'd, I'd never, after all. You're not my pet. Eee! I'm not going along with this nonsense anymore. Got it? No more Mr. Nice Guy. It was, it was, it was with your sibling when you got heat stroke. Nothing eventful happened. Okay. That's good that he didn't die, though. It was on purpose this time. Maybe Ren got heat stroke. Let's let's see what her story is when she gets back. Ren is the type of person to get heat stroke. Yeah, I mean she she's done she's done like boating before, so I wouldn't like. Yeah, it, it, it would make sense. Stroking. She's yeah she's stroking the water. Tell me what's in your well tell me what's inside your bag instead. Nothing special, mostly just all sorts of books. I've taken all the pens and notebooks out of there, and I'm not interested in anything else. You used to go to school, didn't you? Yeah, I did. I had a blast all the way. Really? Are you sure you understood my question? Do you think everything in my life should be doom and gloom? Well, you're wrong! Alright, what'd you like the most about there? Um, well, the rooms are really bright, but not like home. That's it? Don't rush me! Let me remember. 
Well, the beds were always soft, but the foot, the beds in school. By the way, I attended all the classes. The others, all, the others always skipped. They probably got told off so hard. A small, gently absorbed in warm memories. You never graduated, though. Yeah. You remember your last day there? I remember my last day of school. It was a good day. Um, before COVID happened. So technically, like my last day of high school, was it was a good day. Was I a got good day. um. Yeah, I got I got Chick Fil A. Oh, nice. Yeah. What do you like? What, to was, what was your last day of high school before COVID? My last day of high school before COVID. Yeah. Um, or, yeah, high school. Well, my last day of school before COVID was um. I'm still in school now. Um, I'm not in college. Um, no, you're not a grown up. Was we were reading Fahrenheit 451. That's a good book. And I I, I hate it actually. <laughs> really? I thought it was. I thought it was okay. I really don't like Ray Bradbury's writing. Um, I actually never mind. I didn't really like it actually because it just ends so badly with the nuke happening at the end. Because then COVID happened. Oh well, you didn't miss much. It's, it um, doesn't end so well. what happened was I'd accidentally read too far in the book to where we were supposed to be, and we were gonna have like an in-class discussion on the book, and I like spoiled someone dying or something. <gasps> and then everyone was like, oh my god, JD. Um, and then after that, the pandemic happened. That was my <laughs> You caused the pandemic! <laughs> uh, so there's that also was the last the... day of school I had before COVID. There was also the four Fahrenheit 451 movie. We watched it in class, and it you sucked it ass. Class. Yeah, yeah I, I can't imagine that would make for a good movie. Ray Bradford, his writing is so, like, pretentious to me, I don't know. Um... Uh, Do you think mealworms would be that. crunchy or soft? Mealworms? I'm gonna say crunchy. Yeah. I feel like they would be best to eat dried. It was a normal day. Dad picked me up earlier than usual. He told me that I'm already too old for the school curriculum. I also realized that some time ago. The tasks are way too easy. Then we got into the car and went home. Mom greeted us there. and We had dinner and went to our oh, rooms. I remember what I was gonna say. Can I say? What? Yeah. I'm raising my hand, like, teacher, teacher, please! Um, raise your hand, raise your hand! My friends are gonna re watch Truman Show in class. Oh, really? I'm jealous. That's, that, like, that's a really good movie! Yeah. When will they make you Truman Show 2 post production? You posted something in Uliburu? Oh, I can't wait to see. I'll, I'll show it after stream. Okay, what happened then? I don't remember. Does it even matter? Tell me about it again. Is your memory that bad? Please? Fine. That day I met, picked me up school earlier, explained to me that I need to grow up. It's not that I could completely grasp what he meant. Either way, I didn't resist. We got into the car and went home. Mom greeted us there. We had dinner together and went to our own separate rooms. Is she like an adult? I think so. She's like a fail girl, you know? Oh, yeah. And you'll point in Uh, like, tell me about it uh, again. I'm afraid of actually- Sure, tell me about it again. Oh. Dad dragged me out of the school building while I was scratching and biting. The teachers didn't interfere. That scene was ordinary for them. Who knows what the little brat has done? Then he pushed me into the car and we drove home in complete silence. Mom greeted us there. We had dinner together and went to our own separate rooms. Please, let's not discuss this further. Tell me- I don't want to- I don't want to tell her again. Why am I doing this to her? Dad brought milk, milk. on our way home. Oh, yeah. Milk! Again. I hate milk so much. Mom was not home. Again. I hate mom so much. What happened next? Suddenly I feel someone's eyes on my hand on my back. Knowing that these moments could should never be able be never be never ever be ignored, I turn around. But there's nothing there. What happened next? Everything that happened next happened after something that led everything that happened that led to everything that happened after what had happened. I look at my bag again, light pouring into the room through the window glints in the, on the middle parts. And there's some shadow underneath it, which means it's real, sadly. I don't care anyway! I almost end up kicking the bag in a fit of sudden anger, but I managed to stop myself in the nick of time. If I move it even an inch, the whole picture would have collapsed and I'd go blind! It's already happened countless times. What do you mean you go blind? I've spent months memorizing the location of every item in my room. That's why I can see them so clearly and vividly. You won't get it. You won't get it, Gif. You won't get it. Yeah, look at your feet, buddy. Look at your feet. 
I look down and see the oh, small yeah, insect. <gasps> Pog! It's barely glowing and it can't fly. I guess this firefly is really tired. I bent down to pick it up. The firefly starts glowing brightly as soon as I touch it and then it flies up. There you go, little go. There, there you go, boy. Good job. After doing a victory lap around the room, it flies toward me at a high speed. I shut my eyes, anticipating the firefly to enter my ear. It's exactly what happens. After it gets inside, it buzzes for a little while and then goes all silent. This one's kind of sad. I wonder why. It doesn't matter. What matters is that it's no longer home. Alone. Should I just go searching? Can you can you search the garbage zone? Not yet. Maybe I have to search everything else. Oh, the fan. Fan. Oh, there's so fan. much. Fun. Yeah. There's, there's so many things. Who, who would have known that she would have a bad time at school? <laughs> What's funny about that? I imagine myself being a firefly that is looking straight into a giant fan. And? Relatable. I'd be so jealous! The only thing preventing me, prevent, for, ugh, the only thing preventing it from flying is a cage that's locked in, and the and the cable. It's like an inmate if you think about it. It's so sad. Yeah. Let's continue searching. F fan had note. Oh, oh, look at this. Whoa, whoa. I think. Ninety-nine percent of players miss this. Yeah. What's this? Okay. What? That's that's what? that's required for true end probably. Yeah, I got true end. Right. <laughs> okay, I'm so good at point and click adventure games. There's what's, more. What's there? the radio? Yeah, there's a radio and there's something above that. The radio doesn't do much. It just does oh, okay. things. Okay, there's something above the radio. I thought. Yeah, it's these. Yeah, okay. What are those? Ah, those. Those are the photos of my best memories. They're blank. I stare at them so intensely that I burned them with my eyes. <laughs> Now they're just covering the cracks in the walls. Cracks? Forget it. Are we continuing the search or what? Okay. Uh, oh, clock! Clock. I look at the alarm clock. Time continues its unstoppable flow. It's so late. Are you tired? You bet I am. You bet I am. I let out a theatrical yawn. Ooh, I just made all you yawn. I, I just... Uh, wait, dude, you ever, like, you ever read the word yawn and yawn? Yeah, yeah, it happens. It happens when you, it's like, like, it's empathy. I, I get what you mean. Yeah. I've, I've read Dr. Seuss's sleep book many times. And hold my arms to the sides. One, two. Then I raise them above my head. Three, four. Maybe a little workout will help me freshen up. Hey, dude, do you remember the exercises you've been taught? I think so. I took a hesitant stance. What was it? Heels together, toes apart? Whatever, I'll go with that. Count five da countdown. Five minutes. Fine, you have a clock right there in front of you, though. I can't look at its hands for too long. Okay. At first, I feel like they start moving in the wrong direction, and then they start- and then they disappear altogether. And then things always get messy. Last time I saw a pair of eyes on the clock face. And also, I used to hear voices back in the day. They pleaded for help, I think. What a mess. Truly a mess. It was a mess, right? A mess. Well, are you counting down? My god, finally. What do you mean? I was trying to get through you for half an hour, oh my god. That's like huh? the extremely terrible skip button. It really is! <laughs> Do you see the firefly? No? Can okay, you stretch it then? Is there anything The, the skip ending is like one of the, it's so wait, wait, good. Wait, wait, wait. Go, huh? go up. Oop, up. Yeah, this, right? See? Yeah. Just, can you click that? Oh, it's just on the radio, okay. Don't like the noises! This is actually gas? Oh, this. Is there anything else that's not a radio? This is some Morbid's music. Um... I think I got everything. What, did you see the gorilla? Right over here? Here's gorilla. Oh. Oh, umbrella! There we go. The umbrella emanates a faint sense of coolness. No wonder it's the only thing that defends me against the thunderclouds that gather under my ceiling. Such a blessing that I can do it without my help. Still, a firefly won't hide in a place like this. I'll catch a cold and be able to be unable to fly. Let's check it. Why? I'm sure we won't find anything there. Okay, buddy. Oh, okay. Oh, oh my god, that's scary. <laughs> I just press escape. Let me save the game, actually. Are we done searching? Oh, the lights! Wait, the lights. I feel like there's like more things at being added. 
Like I, I, I feel like I wasn't be able to. Well, I wasn't able to click yeah, this before. That's, but... that's weird. Yeah. Are you serious? What's wrong? Just think about it. Why would fireflies be attracted to light? I think they're quite self-sufficient already in that regard. Well, if only they pur purposely want to lower their self-esteem. Hmm. Alright. Gotta check the garbage zone again. No. We always gotta check the gar- Oh, there- oh, that's the radio. Hang on, wait, was there something to the right of the radio? I thought I saw something. Nah, no. I think we've gotten everything. Uh. I'm looking. Oh, um, wait. I'm. Uh, no, that's just the plugs. Never mind. I feel like there was a secret to that, like, one thing right here. That's, that's, that's gonna gone. be required for True End. Yeah, probably. Gotta get True End. Yeah, gotta get True End. Yeah, maybe you should hold it really hard. The garbage zone might just be unsearchable. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> accidentally switched scenes accidentally. Oops, okay. Well, I guess we're done. Alright, let's finish. Finish searching. Then. Yep. After this, I'm gonna go eat dinner. Okay. You found all the fireflies! Amazing! Oh yeah, baby. I guess. Hey. I ran. We found I ran. Have, you ever had heat, have you ever had heat stroke? Dude, I've been really sweaty. <laughs> Are you having heat stroke right now? I've managed to gather my thoughts, but something still worries me. On the other hand, I, I wasn't supposed to be happy anyway. Why not? I lose something and then find it, it's just gonna go back to the starting point. No changes at all. A zero sum. And then happiness is always about being positive, right? You shouldn't think too much, it hurts you. I wanna sleep. Why don't you get some fresh air before sleeping? What do you mean? Go to the balcony, breathe in some air. Somehow those words triggered a panic attack in me. I subconsciously step away from the balcony. What? Don't- I don't think that's a good idea. Yeah, dad kinda killed yourself like, like, like that. Why? This may sound silly, but yeah, kind of I feel like someone is what? watching me. There's no one. Someone. There's no way someone cares about you that much. Uh, all right. I'm going to kill yourself. <laughs> I am going to kill yourself. Hi, Olympics. How are you doing? What are you gonna do? What's a silly question? I'm gonna sleep, of course, hoping that tomorrow will only be tomorrow will only come after a year or a decade. Imagine myself to be outside my mortal shell, but at the same time, still being me. Ridiculous, like a milk outside of a bag of milk. <gasps> oh, oh, oh! Said she said the thing! And yet? You have to talk out loud for me to understand that you're worried about me. I know that already. Also, now that our time is running short, you won't take another pill. Of course not. In fact, I won't take it tomorrow, either. And the day after tomorrow. And never ever! So goodbye, then? No. I have one more small favor to ask, a really, really small one. What is it? I've blurted out way too much today already. A lot of stuff I want to forget forever. I don't blame you, but was it really necessary? You'll see tomorrow. No, I wouldn't be able to sleep like this. Fine, what's the favor? Uh... I nervously scratch my wrist and bite on my lower, lower, lower lip. You afraid to tell me? Yes! I'm also scared that something bad might happen if I tell you. I'm also scared that when it, something bad happens, something way worse will happen. Stop, I get it already. So I won't leave you alone until you tell me. Boy! No, you! I'll just go watch some dog tools. Yeah, um, Resident Sleeper put dog tools back This is a Resident Sleeper, look at that! She's Resident <laughs> Sleeping. She's Resident Sleeping. I crawl into my sleeping bag. The lower part of the room is very cold. Sleeping on the floor must, like, be uncomfortable, but I guess it's Sometimes it can bag. be really comfortable. Sometimes it can be goaded. Should Milk be poured good. outside of its bag uh, can never go back like, in. Oh, good. true. Is that is that the like uh, message of the game? The lower part of the room is very cold. I hurry to wrap myself in blankets, even though the electric heater is working very hard to keep warm. I'm sad because the dreams won't come anymore. You won't believe me if I tell you how I dealt with it at first. Of course I believe you. I know it was a joke. 
Well, anyway, I washed my face, brushed my teeth, lied down, and started imagining that I'm watching a dream. I didn't sleep at all. I didn't sleep at all, of course, and always looked sleepy in the morning. After a week of insomnia, I started feeling weird and saying things. Letters floating in the air, a strange silhouette that appeared in the most extreme, most unexpected of places. Bulging eyes of trembling pale pupils. It was scary, you know. And one day, I almost died. Just collapsed in the middle of the room and couldn't move for a while. And then the silhouettes, the letters start were hanging over me, hissing. It was horrible. And well deserved, I guess. I felt like I was caught on the biggest lie in the world. Yes, it felt exactly like that. After that, I stopped. But the silhouettes, letters, and eyes stayed there. I guess they liked this place. They always follow in my wake, peeping at me, and I'm kind of scared of them, and I can't argue with them. But today! Today! Well, I. It's too scared to tell me. Of course, they're still listening, you know! Use your hands. Alright. I start chaotically twirling my fingers with enthusiasm, forming complex shapes. You want me to tell you a bedtime story? Shh. I was trying so hard here, don't you get it? They'll hear you! No one can hear you. So what do you say? I'd be happy to, but I have no idea how to tell them. Oh, it's incredibly easy! Just talk about something about stopping! <laughs> like you, JD, talking about dwellers! <laughs> we got an ice dweller. <laughs> an ice dweller. We got, we got a... We got some kind of ice dweller in the chat. <laughs> Mods, uh, this. crush his skull. We just get rid of this ice dweller. <laughs> what is the other thing he says? He calls them something else, too. I don't remember. I forget it. He went outside camping once, and it was great. I, I okay, went I camping outside know. my backyard once. Just talk something about stopping. Sounds silly. I have a Neanderthal in the chat. I have an ice <laughs> Neanderthal. Neanderthals in chat? Neanderthals, um, rise up. What's not? Head expanders in the chat. And meaningless. You know what you're talking about. I know enough to realize that we'll, we'll just end up wasting time. Let's focus on something actually important. Boring. Come on, close your eyes. Oh. Let me get rid of this ice dweller. You milk Shut inside of a wine her. glass. Oh shit. Not again. Oh, Whoa, yeah, it's like the first game. Not again. I woke, I wake up on a wooden bench. In front of me lies a narrow, dimly lit alley. An awfully familiar road. Where could I have seen it? Finally! Oh, oh, a person! The boy. A boy. I hear a voice coming from the side. I turn around and see a boy with a weird expression on his face. Y You're late! Um, how are you? Boy blinks in bewilderment. We're not going anywhere like this! Try again! Then he takes a very deep breath. You are late! I stare at him confused. I think we're like kids? A flashback to like when we were kids? He stares back, also confused. Flashback. Sorry? The boy nods, satisfied. See? Much better! Do you have a name? My name's Tresca! No, it's not. I, gi I give the, the brat an, an evaluating look. He's so young, yet already coming at me with questions like that. <laughs> Too personal. None of your business. And besides, will anyone tell me what I'm doing here? Hey, that's rude. It's not like there's someone anybody here except besides me. Haven't they told you anything? I know they're all. I know. I uh know all there is to know for one. But what? You're obligated to escort me to the store. Tresca says that and strikes a victory pose. No way, I'm doing that. You do understand that refusal is futile. Well, aren't you full of yourself? I'm serious. I'm not the one who decided that. Do you think I'm delighted with your company? He's weird. Um, weird! Constantly shifting wacko. between happiness, sadness, loudness, and silence. He's a wacko, <laughs> yeah. And his name is stupid. Are we going, right, are we going to what? Alright, right, go eat dinner. Mm. I'm eating dinner. JD's so bad at this. <laughs> what are you eating right now, Ren? G uh, I'm eating Philly cheesesteak, cheese, onions, and... That's fries. pretty good. I'd be happy to, but I don't know the way. Tresca puts on a cunning smile. I bite my lower lip in frustration. Well, actually, I can probably move back now. Oh, hi, Mike Wazowski. There you go. I'll be honest with you, I don't like you. He suddenly burst out laughing in reply. I do like you, though! 
He grabs my hand without hesitation. Um, boundaries, buddy? 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 I don't even That's Brad <laughs> and Buddy combined. <laughs> I don't have time to retort. Lead the way! What do you do? Someone knocked on the door weirdly early into the day, and as soon as you opened it, uh, it turned out... It turned into the milk art style, and then there was the milk girl? I would be scared. And she had a giant bag of milk triangles, like that one Spongebob chocolate episode. Milk triangles? I need a- have I ever told you this stream? I think it'd be really good to put- What's- what's the stream? stream? Okay, so this dream. Um, you know that scene dreaming. from- you know that part of Breaking Bad where Jesse and Walter are, like, in the trunk? Of a, uh, of, like, trunk. a car? Season- season one, very end. Yes, I do. Yeah, yeah, with, uh, no, with, uh, Tuko. Tuko. So, imagine I was, like, in that scenario, just by myself, yeah. bound up and gagged, and in the front, um, someone was driving, I hear, like, the police, there's, like, people driving up, and you want to know who the f it was in the fucking front seat? The who? fucking annoying orange with the parent. <gasps> Wait, you've told like, me this story already. Yeah, but I want to fucking say it right now on stream, I want everyone to hear this. I yeah. fucking, they were like laughing or something like they would in the cartoon and they were just like shooting the cops away. Uh-huh. And the dream that rounded it, I just kept going on. I remember, huh. I don't know, man. I, I like awesome. woke up like fucking laughing. You know, that show was amazing. <laughs> this is an only plays bit. <laughs> I can't even do a good like annoying orange voice. Hey, Apple. No. Knife. No. Uh, our trip to the store went fine, if not for the fact that Tresca was walking way faster than me. <laughs> Girl milk? Um. Okay, buddy. Uh, band phrase. Band user? Question mark. <laughs> On the other hand, at times he stopped abruptly and went backwards, studying the ground underneath his feet. In the end, the trip took a lot longer than it should have. Um. Is this Russian? I mean, or a Russian person. Yeah, I might. Yeah. After reaching the store's doors, we were greeted by a sign. We're closing in 20 minutes. <laughs> what a bright idea to indicate their working hours in this way. I don't think we're actually kids, by the way. In this such dream? They probably have a special staff for this. Someone who runs to change the sign every five minutes. It's convenient. Are you joking? Yeah. You're so annoying. It's much better than being boring. How old are you, by the way? None of your business. Uh, 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 and what's your name? No business. I was ready to slap the living hell out of the brat, but a scary looking man suddenly appeared behind the glass. He's holding a cardboard sign that says, We're closing in 15 minutes. Let's go, what are you waiting for? Okay, yeah. Dude, I wish I had a liquid brain. It, it would go like sloshing my in my head. You'd be like, oh. I want a poo brain. A poo brain? That was smell. After another round of going across the long row of canned products, we realized that we're lost. I can't believe you don't know where they sell milk. Um, maybe we should ask someone else for directions? Sure! Hey, wait up! Just go, let's go my hand, we, and walks confidently towards one of the few store's customers. That person is standing with her back to us, studying something on the shelf. Hello, can I- Can't hear neither the second part of his question, nor the reply he gets, but my good-for-nothing friend freezes in place. Looking the customer straight in the eye, I hurry towards them. Okay, so I guess we are kids. I guess this guy's big. Is he yours? The customer talks to me. He speaks with disgust while wearing a scornful expression. Um, I am. Um, he's yours. Please get him away from me. Yes, I'm sorry. I grab Tresco's hand and lead him away. He's still looking at the customer. His Mouth ajar and eyes popped. He's also shaking. Might sleep in 10 minutes. When you, when, when you do sleep, in picks good night. Only when you turn the corner, Tresca calms down. What was that? He got so scared, he said, What? No, not again. And suddenly, Tresca begins screaming again like crazy. Again, starts screaming again like crazy. I cover his mouth with my hand. His face is burning, he's crying. Can you act normal? You don't understand! Of course I don't. I don't understand anything! And knowing other people is still wrong though. This is something you don't understand, it seems. You're mean! Who, me? 
Tresca pushes me away and runs off. Okay, bye. Drat. At the edge of my vision, I see the store's staff hang a new sign on the door. There you are. I meet Tre oh, that's me. <laughs> I meet Tresca at the cash register. Before that, I managed to visit the milk department after finding out where it is. Milk department? <coughs> hey, girl, can you show me your milk department? <laughs> yeah, sure, babe. Oh. Hey, you move. I hear an angry voice coming from the other side of the long queue that has formed after Tresca. I squeeze through the toward him. What happened? The boy doesn't respond. He just looks at his feet and sniffs. The cashier towers over him. It's a bag of milk lying between them. It's more like a box. Is it yours? Yes. Just leave him home next time. <laughs> okay. People in the queue nod in agreement. Pay for the goods, please. Yes, of course. And the waiting fee. What? You heard me. I, I did, but that's unheard of. Tresco starts giggling all of a sudden. Oh, he's, his smile changed. Oh! Oh, okay! What? I can't say that. And for the fact that your son's a... A uh, dumbass, too. What? You heard me. You know what? In a fit of rage, I throw a banknote to the cashier of much higher value than needed, even counting in all the steward fees, and then grab a bag of milk and turn out my heels. We're leaving, Tresca! We spend the whole trip back in silence. At some point, we end up turning right towards a gas station. There, Tresca finally breaks the silence. Do you like ice cream? No. You don't, like, you don't like ice cream? Okay. I look at the boy's face. A, fl a light flickers in his eyes for a brief moment and then goes out. You know? He turns away from the path and walks walk straight toward the highway with determination. I stare, at, I stare back, confused. Hi. It seems like you're not helping me at all. A new playful light flickers in Tresca's eyes. We woke up. The art style is so good, by the way. Oh, I did it. That was fairly short, but I'm pretty sure there's a, uh, a lot of uh, hidden stuff you can get. Wow, that was that was a very nice uh, reading experience. Nice. Would you drink spicy milk? What is spicy milk? I feel like spicy milk would be like carbonated milk. Ghost Funeral. Ghost Funeral did a, a very good job. Wow. Yeah, it's very, like, Lane, right? I, I, or, um... Gratuitous Lane. Is Gratuitous Lane the same thing as the anime? I don't... No, I, I don't think so. <laughs> Eating spicy food and then drink spicy milk and it just gets worse. That's why. Serial Experience Lane. I, I once saw a art of Serial Experience Lane, but like she was doing Serial Experience, like, like experience of like cereal, like putting a uh, Apple Jacks and uh, Fruit Loops in the same pot. Yeah, the art of this game is so, so good. Oh, I did it. Neat. Okay, I, I got four achievements. There are six achievements we should get. Um, I, feel there's, I feel like there's so much more. Serial experience lane. Yeah, exactly like that. Let me look, let me look it up. Milk... Outside of a bag of milk. Endings? Guide. <laughs> K. 
Okay. Also, I died? Huh? Like, one of the achievements is his like, first death. And then there's a, there's a second death achievement. So I did something. <laughs> You're imagining carbonated milk? I want some carbonated milk. I probably exist, right? Hi, Mom. Bye, Mom. I gotta click real fast. Ooh, oh, 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 there we go. Spicy carbonated milk. Yeah, Milk Girl was pretty, like, was a trooper. Look at her, look at her. I love Milk Girl. Okay, there's the, the phone ending. It requires the player to find a secret item in the girl's bedroom. I kind of, I kind of want to like. I don't know. I'll, I'll see if I can get the phone ending. But I want, uh, I would recommend you guys to play the game, this game for yourself and get the endings. Okay, the phone ending requires a player to get a secret item. I got the secret item. Between the fan and the radio, in the lower corner of the screen, there's a transcript paper. Yeah, I got it. So that, but apparently, the number of a pizzeria on it. When she still asleep, she have a dream. She's texting the pizzeria. What I I, th I thought I got it. You're gonna have nightmares for this game, probably. This is kind of a scary game, but not too scary. So, but apparently, has no pizza yet. When she goes to sleep, she's trying. To okay. Let's try not dying here. Oh, unless it's like unavoidable. Did I just call her pathetic? Good job. <laughs> You're gonna have nightmares from carbonated milk. Uh. I died actually. Oh, I'm gonna die here. I think you die when you're lying on the floor. I don't know how you died the second time though. Matcha? I've never. Matcha? I've never. I don't think I've ever drank matcha before. Like matcha tea or matcha milk? Wait. Matcha. It's a T, okay, yeah. Good, I love the angles right here though, it's so nice. Here's the fireflies. Ah! Oh. I died. There you go. Oh, shit, I had like an auto clicker. Or maybe like. Is there like a skip button, probably? Wowie! Wowie! Okay, here's the paper right here. What's this? Collect all six fireflies and skip both death scenes. Skip both death scenes? You okay, so I messed up. up. <laughs> I fucked up. How did I skip that death scene, though? That's uh, weird. Uh, Let's see. He's becoming a resident sleeper. Please oh, really me. open up um, Duck Game. Open up Duck Game right now? Right now. Okay, wait. No, I, I can't, I, I'll do a Duck Game stream. They'll, they'll see it on stream. Yeah, but we can just... Play some now. Tomorrow. Uh. <laughs> oh, this guy's crying. Okay. Milk outside of a bag of milk. No death. How do I not die? 
first death. The player has to choose. That's the thing. I have no idea. This was weird. Oh, okay. Oh, bye, Impex. Let's see. Uh, probably like, hi, mom, again. So I died because I asked why she was doing this. She was lying on the floor. That's funny. Sometimes that sometimes it happens though. There she is. Hi. Stop lying. She does, yeah, she has such, mom has such great eyeliner, true. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah you're true. I might, like, insult her. And I get the, 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 the baddest ending. Okay, there you go. Let's not kill her. Sometimes I lie on the floor though. I know I did that. Like I've been, I have a, a floor liar when I had dogs, because dogs like it when you like go on the floor. They like go to you for some reason. Maybe because like they can uh, see more of you while you're, while you're on the floor. I want. I don't know. Here's fireflies. Okay, we're here. Good job. Okay. You're not streaming to me. Forget about it. Go to bed. You're not streaming to me. Oh, I'm not streaming for you, lol. Okay, stream for you now. Okay. Okay, I didn't die. Nice. Cool. Dogs are vertically challenged. They're small. They're small creatures. I think I remember where all the fireflies are. Here. Click. I'll just click everything. Cause I have forgotten on the, forgotten. Here. Radio. Um. Bed. Backpack. I think okay, we skipped all the text explaining her horrible school situation. I probably uh, missed a lot of things in this game, but I will. I want to at least get the the number, the ending of this thing. Hopefully, like, I don't think you have to choose the right text boxes to get the fireflies. If I, if you do, I might have messed up from like just spamming, clicking everything. I got an achievement for something. Yeah. Can't forget the cupboard. And uh I think I got everything here. Just 
So if I go to sleep, I should get the ending. Oh, I went outside the balcony. Let's see. I might die here, actually. <laughs> oh, look at that! Balcony. This is new. I actually have to speak. My apartment building looks like a bottomless cooking pot, but instead of soot, it has hundreds of concrete and metal boxes on its walls. There are lights in those windows, and there's muffled voices coming from the inside. The howling wind spirals up and spits and splits into hundreds of independent streams. Seems like it wants to be heard by every single person living here. It's literally like a... Oh, it's a weird apartment shaped. It's like there's more houses and more. It's like a cylinder. You must feel so lonely living Probably in an endless square. silence. Might be a square. Your apartment building is really pretty weird, right? Yeah, this is the balcony. I could see the horizon from my window before, and the buildings grew for miles in both directions. I, I guess at some point it circled around and closed on itself. Nothing unusual about that. Sure. How do you feel? Don't you feel something? I definitely feel sometimes it's more than enough. You're still an you're anxious, aren't you? Of course. Moreover, I'm completely terrified. Wasn't that obvious? You look in every direction, but not up. Now this. <gasps> it's the thing! It o! The O! It's not something you're terrified. It's hard to explain. I caught the middle railing and let my legs hang down. I sneak short glances at the abyss from time to time, but replies with angry cold breath. That's how we interact, like old friends. Sometimes I feel like the whole world pretends to be crazy. As if it's trying to make me believe in something that doesn't exist. It's weird, isn't it? Yes, but... At the same time, it makes me feel a little bit happy. Everything around me was created for my sake to deceive, trick, and confuse me. If that's true, I guess I'm not so crazy myself, after all. You believing in this is the definition of craziness. You're probably right. I guess a wind blast against the pot's walls, Ooh. smashing the glass to dust and Dude, blowing away the ending. The... Oh, did I? We're doing another ending yeah. now. Okay. Is this the O ending? Yeah, this is the It's uh, I went scene to scene the right balcony. There. Oh, Check okay. What's what happened also, in the last ending? Can you tell me? Um, I was with some kid, and they, um, someone called them the R word. Oh, um, it was at the end? Uh, and then we, like, left, and then the end happened. Oh, okay. And then, oh, and then I woke up and I started crying. Oh. It was a dream. But this is a, this is a different. This is me going to the balcony. I actually tried to go to a different ending with the paper. There is there is an ending with that paper. Remember okay. that one? But like I the think, little one? Yeah. And I can avoid it. Like, you remember that one scene where, like, I died? Yeah. It, it's, it, yeah, I avoided that. Oh, but I think stop. I'm going to die here again if I'm going to the balcony. Another gust of wind blasts against down. the pot's walls, the smashing the glass to dust and blowing away the concrete crust. I, on the hand, feel a gentle breeze that only ruffles my hair. I still haven't come up with a code word. You are the you are the only, uh, you were the one to remember your promise. You don't need a code word anymore. Something bad's gonna happen. Oh no! I don't like it when this happens. I only remember, I only I want to remember certain things only when I want to. Unless you made that promise, now keep it. But you need to keep in mind that this. From, that from this moment on, every word would be, bring me pain. I bend down and imagine falling to the abyss. I have exactly two minutes before I meet my end. Two minutes? That is a fucking while. Oh my god, we live like one mil. Oh! We fall. We fell. We got the bad ending. It. We slipped. You're just imagining it. It's okay. Whoa. The animation is really nice. I had a friend online, my Animal best friend, jam. even though the combination of letters he used instead of his name wasn't odd. Wasn't that cool. Well, the combination of pixels he had instead of his photo was also boring and unattractive. This is so strange and wrong, breaking the rules of being online. Why was he doing that? Maybe his code was a few lines short? I don't quite what you mean. I could oh, tell you about like those rules. that's like a programmer joke. Yeah, this sure. guy, this guy, his code's a, a few lines short, if you know what I mean. <laughs> I can't find them anywhere, but I'm smart, so I figured it out myself. Although, I'm not sure if I should do that. When I try to say what I think out loud, I tend to make mistakes. If I make just a single one, everything that comes after contradicts my thoughts. And I end up, end up, with, the, and I end up with the opposite position. And I don't want that. According to that logic, it's better, to shut your, it's better for you to keep your mouth shut forever. Yeah, it's my dream! 
Keep your mouth shut, never get up from bed, never see or, any, or hear anything. Just dream on and on. Uh, why is everything so terrible? Don't, distra don't get distracted. So what happened? What was, what was that about your friend? My friend? Ah, oh, yes. He, he was brazen enough to... Guys, your thoughts? He somehow made me believe that he was real. He kept describing someone else's life to me in detail, as if it was him. And he expected me to do the same. And then I told him everything about myself, without hiding a single thing. Uh-oh. Don't do that, oh. guys. Don't... Don't do that. Yeah, animal jam. I grit, I grit my... <laughs> she got animal jammed! I grit my teeth. The wind whips my face without mercy. It slices my skin into uneven stripes, as if a thin piece of cloth. He knew more about me than anyone else in the world. You know what he did? Yes. Oh. Oh. Sending an army of bots to harass me was probably fun. And what's more important, it was a win-win situation. They spawn here and there simple bits of code that are effortless to run. No wonder the algorithm assigns the pattern more often than the others from the list. Text and video generators get to work at the same time. My name surfaces on the web more and more. It's unbearable. Unbearable. From around every corner, every balcony, ceiling, attic, wall, I feel many pairs of watchful eyes directed at me. And now they watch me from the screens, too. But I'll put an end to it. I've decided long ago. Time ago. Though, maybe I only decided that only... Dang. Oh, I that died. Bubsy. I'm cool. Let's go Shed back inside. A million pieces? Yeah. That gave me, you know what, that gave me, like, a cool idea for, like, a game. Yeah? Imagine, like, an RPG, like, something like that happens, where you're, like, talking to another character, and you're both, like, falling, and you just have to talk to them as quickly as possible before you hit the ground. And that's, like, a that, short that your R R That'll be your RPG? No, that would just be a part of it or something. Oh, like a scene. Yeah, Interesting. yeah. Huh. Okay. And the conversation is scripted to go on, like, much longer than you could ever have in two minutes, but you just have to try and squeeze as much in of it in that time. Oh, we didn't fall. Okay. Yeah, it was just okay. it was just, a, it was just it your was imagination, imagined. buddy. Enter my room. Thankfully, it hasn't changed one bit since the, moment, the minutes I was outside. Well, last second thought, it goes toward my laptop and yank the power cable from the outlet. That's it. That's it. That's it. What are you gonna do? Emily's Away is a very good game. I like the Emily's Away. I, I played all three. What happened is that we, we imagined ourselves falling down the balcony. Uh, peppermint. Yeah, I was just imagining. What's a silly question? I'm going to sleep, of course. Hoping that tomorrow will only come after a year or a decade. Imagining myself to be outside of my mortal shell, but at the same time still being me. Ridiculous. Like a milk outside of a bag of milk. Like she said the thing! Outside a bag of milk. Let me short. Take another pill. That was crazy. It's the same, con it's the same uh, conversation we had. That's, she sound that's what she sounds like. There's an EP scene. This isn't, this, is this going to be the same ending? Uh, let's see. Oh, there are no sounds in the Oily Fans Discord server? Uh-oh. There are what? There are no sounds. Sounds? There are no sounds. Oh, what do you, get? What, what do you mean by that? What? Oh, yeah, right, yeah, I forgot. In, that, in Emily's Away, there's a scene where you talk to two girls at the same time, but you can only confront one at the end. Yeah, I forgot about that. There are no sounds. There's no sounds. Let's see, is this the same part where we meet that one kid? Oh, it is not! This is different! Oh, fuck, this is different. Okay. Thank you for choosing our pizzeria. You know, this place is so empty, I though I don't feel particularly good or bad because of it. Is this, is this us? Oh, I think we're typing. I'm all alone, but at the same time, I feel like I'm not. There's a lot of thoughts in my head, but they always keep me entertained. I thought it was the pizzeria guy talking. 
I can create a whole world of them. I'm sure it'll be able to fill the void around me if I try hard enough. Although, no matter how much I think, my surroundings don't change. Yes, things happened in my head, but they never left its premises. And it's not like I tried to suppress them. Maybe they're afraid of come to come out? Like a pi what type of- well, like a, what kind of pizza? Like the order? Anyway, there's so much space in my head that could be put to good use. So every thought would make a senseless and merciless circle in my head, destined to go back to where it started. But there should be an end somewhere. You can't just wander off around somewhere. What do you think? I know it sounds scary, but it's not scarier than constantly existing amongst the void. This place is safe, and nothing bad will happen here. Nothing good will happen either, though. P. Please note, we have a special offer right now. Three pizzas for the price of two. Yeah, there's probably nothing good in having the same thoughts over and over. What's the point of having them anyway? I could have escaped from here, but I feel like my thoughts aren't helping me at all. They should be ashamed, probably. It's nobody's fault that I can't even see a door here. I would have had it easier with one. I tried to, fin I tried to find it. It turned out to be a waste of time. No matter where I look, it's not looking good. <gasps> but not intended. <laughs> Thanks. And that strips me from the last bit of uh, hope for salvation. Pizza guy. I think maybe she's just maybe she's just tiny. That's why she was like the, the height of the kid. We also have a discount program for new customers. You can learn about it on your account page. Don't you think that me being here is also a waste of time? What's the point in that? I can just keep on thinking. And even then, my thoughts are as meaningless and empty as everything else. Does it mean that I'm not filling the void, but am part of it? Then why should I feel anything? Why should I know that I exist? Although, I'm not even sure about that. This place is always neither warm nor cold. It's neutral. But at the same time, if I think about it warmth, I feel warmth. Maybe this world co corresponds to my thoughts. I wouldn't want to admit that. I'm completely empty. I'm not the reason everything had disappeared, right? Can't I just adapt and get used to having nothing around me since I can't do anything about it? It's night. Are you ready to make an order? Yes, that's right. I shouldn't care. It's empty here, and it makes me feel neither good nor bad. Are, is she like I don't know texting what the, the pizza guy? What is going on? Me neither. I think she's alternating between texting the pizza. I don't think she's actually texting the pizza guy. I think it's just like that. Yeah, but she she has like she's texting something on her phone. I alone, think these are her time. thoughts. I think it's just like framed like this for flavor. Yeah, I'm all alone, but at the I same time, she's actually it feels like texting I'm not. anybody. There are a lot of thoughts in my head, they keep me entertained. I, still don't I could understand. create a whole world with them. This place is safe, and nothing bad will happen here. Nothing good will happen either, though. She said that again? Me being here is a waste of time. I don't fill the void, I'm part of it. This strips me of the last bit of hope for salvation. I shouldn't care. It's empty here, and it's making me feel neither good nor bad. It's nobody's fault that I can't even see the door here. What's the point of having one? I feel like nobody is helping me. They should all they should feel ashamed. I wouldn't want to admit it, but I'm also I'm, I'm all I'm all alone here. I can't do anything about it. Phone. Please no, we have a special four pizzas for a price of two. Holy Damn. shit! Damn, that's a really good offer. I don't care if it's empty here. I feel neither good or bad. Shut I'm up, all get alone. The special deal. Yeah, get the deal. She's about to walk, <laughs> she about to walk on the train tracks? Uh-oh. 
Uh, oh yeah, my head's full of thoughts. They eclipsed the world around me. It definitely feels more like a memory. So I don't think... This place is cramped, but at least it's safe. Every, even though I'll never feel good here. Or just a weird nightmare. Does that mean existing is a waste of time? I need to decide. My thoughts help me. They'll lead me to the ex exit, and I'll be able to feel proud of myself. I'll be oh, able to I hear the train myself. coming. I hear it too. At the same time. I don't care, care anymore. This place is empty, but it makes you feel like I'm bad. Alone. Whole world. Full slots. If I try hard enough, it'll be able to fill all, fill all the void around me. Still. No matter how much I keep thinking, my surroundings don't change. Yes, yeah, something happens. Something happened outside of my head, but... What was it? There's not enough space for my thoughts. It's already filled up with, with something else. Even if there's nothing around me, I'm still here. And my head is full of thoughts. What was that noise? I guess yeah, there's the a inner there's announcer? A yeah, if yeah. I try hard enough... So the world isn't empty, after all. This dialogue is driving me to madness. I, it's me just, it's too. just, oh! I can't see anything. Nope. Can't, can't go that way. Session timeout. Please reload the page. Ah. Uh, I think she got trained. Or maybe she tried to go on the pizza website? Hey, with the pizza here. That was the ending. This is just like repeating the same ending. This cutscene had a lot more weight after the old, one, after the first one. That one just didn't make sense. It maybe it like, makes sense. You just gotta like I don't know, pick apart. Are you guys so you're ready? For me this? You don't understand it. I don't understand it. <laughs> yeah. Are you guys ready for this? What? Is, mm -hmm. What? I'm about to ruin streaming forever. Huh? Oh, no. oh my god! Guys. Thank you for coming to Milk Inside of the Bag and Outside of the Bag. It was this is a really good visual novel. Is it over? It's over. Stream I'm, I'm, over. Uh, uh, stream is over. Uh, okay. Thank you for thank you for coming along. Yeah, this, this is a, a cool game. It's plus a cool game. Yeah, I really love the art style for uh, Outside of the Bag and Milk. And Inside had a really good art style too. First one kind of mid, but the second one kind of good. First one is alright. Uh, <laughs> the first one kind of uncanny. Second one, kind of incredible. Kind of incredible. Also, we have a uh, we have art to show. For me. Also, thank you, JD and Ren, for coming along. Oh yeah. Baby. So it's uh, a, a stream is always good with you guys. Ah, oh, thank you. Die. Oh, they're fucking rebooting RoboCop. Fuck no. Uh. Oh my God, this is so cool. From Foma, uh, this is from. Uh, Fonamono. Uh, they drew art of the stream. Look at that! It's so what cool. Art? That's that's a pretty epic art. This is, this is very cute. I like I like this a lot. That's awesome. This is awesome, yeah. Wait, oh, they also they also showed real bags of milk. They they sent me real bags of milk. Apparently, this is a, what a bag of milk looks like. Uh, it's all like it's very square. Make this a little shorter. But thank you for coming to the stream. If you aren't subscribed already, uh, subscribe. If you want to uh, get notified for future streams, uh, click that bell. And uh, thank you for coming along. Smash the subscribe button. Tomorrow, I'm going to be uh, streaming with JD. Are, are, will you be here tomorrow for the game, JD? I don't know. What? We'll you see. don't know? You will be there. You will be there. You I don't know. I might, have, I might have company. You will be all there. All right, all right. Well, we can get another person that has Duck Game, right, Giant Run? You will be there. Okay. JD, this is not an option. If JD isn't here, 